Check, check. Hello. Can you read me? Buck Thunder. Buck. Buck. Oh, it's me, Phil, your divorce attorney. Welcome to Buck Thunder 2 Xeno Slaughter. Another Buck Thunder game. Your ex-wife is back and more evil than ever. She's sending a bunch of her new blood-sucking boyfriends out. So go shoot them. Just kill them all, Buck. That's, that's the game. Buck, it's me, Phil, your divorce lawyer again. You remember how to move and jump and everything, right? There's shit on the screen that tells you how to do all that stuff. I mean, come on, Buck. This is the second game. You know how to do all this shit. All right, Buck, you're gonna have to use the brand new double jump to get a... Oh, shit. I'm sorry, Buck. I forgot there's no double jump. Just crouch. We gotta try crouching, Buck. Fucking scheduling and scoping bullshit. A fucking crouch prioritized over a double jump. Who is this? Who... Who... who are... Stay sharp, Buck. A bunch of your ex-wife's new alien boyfriends. There they are. Come right out. That's what I'm talking about, Buck. Kill those fuckers. You're the man. I love you, Buck. You're so fucking cool. Oh, I... Oh, my God, Buck. You did it. You opened the door. You're a fucking genius. You are my favorite client. It's me, by the way. Your divorce attorney. Don't forget. I'm Phil, your divorce attorney. Let's go. Let's get moving. Let's defeat your ex-wife. say goodbye to mom and dad before they left for their trip. You know they were pissed, right? Whatever. We got the place to ourselves now. Oh my god. Don't give me that look, narc. What, are you mad that I'm throwing this party tonight? <laughs> it's fine. Mom and dad are gone for a whole fucking week. We can do whatever we want. Here, come on. Try some. <laughs> you know it's good for your depression, right? Okay, we're totally gonna rage tonight. I cannot wait. I whoa, 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 it's kicking in. Oh, oh, finally, there you are. I felt like I was losing my mind. So, do you want any or nah? Fine, more for me then. All right, I'm gonna go get ready for the party. This stuff's gonna last me all week. It is powerful. Mom told me I was in charge. She did it in secret so it wouldn't hurt your feelings and dad said that he flat out doesn't love you. It was actually pretty messed up. By the way, mom left you a note on the fridge. Go read it. Then come meet me outside. I need your help grabbing party shit from the store. You come in or what? So I guess. Holy shit! Oh, what the fuck? Get down and stay quiet. I knew aliens were real. Hey, the bullet die, huh? The bakota! Ha 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 ha! Shun, I She tow hit that one. Hello, what? One, Do you understand what they're saying? Oh shit, look! It's Mr. Pilfrey! He's got that, um, 
What's it called? Uh, dementia. Uh, what's going on out here? Martha, is that you? Oh my god! Oh my god! What did they just do to Mr. Pilfrey? Hola, mi amato. What the fuck is going on? Cho, machiza, wana ho. Luma ne tanda, ula ba giwa la kanga ma. sort of how it works. I guess you guys don't have those here yet. Listen, my name's Kenny. I'm a Gatlian. Uh, we, we gotta kind of, we gotta oh, move. what is it? Is it talking to you? Maybe we should go back to the Ignore house. her. It's very important that you listen to everything I say. Okay, it is your lucky day right now. We can survive this together if you just listen to me. The G3 guys are gonna turn your whole species into drugs. Can you handle a gun? Because, you know, I'm kind of a gun, and if you don't use me to kill those G3 grunts, you, you know, they're gonna... Fuck yeah, there we go. All right, first kill. I am so glad you picked me up. But let's keep going. Not bad, alien. Not bad at all. Let's head to that base. Well, here you go with the G3 war base. Okay, let's just clean house and walk out of here. Nice! You, you, you know, you had to kill them, right? It was either them or you, and me as well, and, and I, I, I would prefer to live. You know, and I have a voice here. I have a choice. Oh, shit, it's a merc! They're tougher! It's like a human into the base. This wasn't... Fuck yeah! Now grab the warp drive! We'll use this to warp the hell off this doomed planet! Sorry, no offense. I don't mean to upset you, but yes, your planet is doomed right now. Okay, listen, don't worry about the beeping. The beeping's fine. It's just, it's gonna blow up soon. We just need to plug this thing into power. Do you have something back in your house? That, you know, do you live in one of these bugs around here? Take us there. We gotta move. We gotta move, move, move. Listen, bring me up close to your face. You can aim better. Perfect, perfect. Now just look down the sights and fire. You're doing great, by the way. Go on, Brown. Do you need some more encouragement? Here, uh, that's my little G3 killer. Oh, look at you, G3 killer. That's your heart, right? The one that the weird alien you were with ran off to? We're almost there! Oh, thank God you're still alive! I just killed an alien! Look! <laughs> I got blood in my mouth! I think we're all gonna die! You got anything in here that emits, I don't know, microwaves? I know it's a lot to ask. What? Like a fucking microwave? Oh, whoa. I can understand your gun now. Translator microbes, they're contagious, but complete. Just move past all this shit! Don't look at me! I don't know what's going on. Your gun was talking about microwaves, right? So go to the microwave then! So... Oh, thank God, it worked! Hey, it, 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 it's just gonna take a second to boot up! Oh my God, that's the scary alien we saw kill Mr. Pilsen. Leader of the G3 cartel, don't resist. Any attempts to fight us would be futile. Crazy. You are now officially the property of the G3 cartel. Fuck. All right, it's go time! Let's get out of here! Wait, get out of here? Where are we going? To find somebody who can help. You ever been to the big city? Because you're about to, except that it's a space city. It's a huge space city, and you're going to be out of your element. And you better just follow my lead. What? What just happened? Looks like we made it. Welcome to Blim City. Did you just warp our entire house? 
to another planet? Yeah, keep up. We'll be safe here. Now take me outside. Whoa, whoa. You're just going to leave me here in, in what, space? Are we, are we in space? Yeah, sorry. I know you're a bit shaken up, but you'll be fine. It's better than getting enslaved by the G3. Trust me. I guess that's true. How the hell are we going to get back to Earth? Uh, we can't. That was a one-way trip. We you're going out there? Into space? Yeah! Welcome to fucking space! So, this is Blim City. Not not bad, huh? I don't know how we're gonna find Gene, though. Let's just ask around. There's all kinds of aliens out here. Let's just... Let's just ask. He, he is famous. Hey, we're looking for Gene Zaruthi and the bounty hunter. Any idea where he might be? Who? N no Do you know how many freaking people live here? And you expect me to know the... Yeah, fuck it. Let's move on. Let's just go. Hey, uh, we're looking... Oh, oh, you don't want to talk to me. Okay, no problem. Yeah, all right. Excuse me, do you have any idea where Gene Zaruthian is? What? That's my name. I'm Gene Zaruthian. But why would you... Oh, wait. You're probably thinking of the famous bounty hunter with the same name as me. Sorry. I'm just some loser accountant. Oh, man. Oh, that's not good. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. I guess you don't need my help. Okay, this isn't going so well, but let's keep asking around. We'll find something, I, I swear. Excuse me, does the bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian live around here? The bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian? Ha, <laughs> uh, you must be confused. Uh, please go. What did you mean by that? Please stop talking to me. Sorry, shot in the dark here, but are you familiar with the Gene Zaruthian? Who? Oh yeah, he's, he's homeless. He's sleeping on a bench right nearby. I just walked past him earlier. I'm really glad I could be so helpful. What? Really? Uh, okay, well, thank you so much. Shit. Good. Fuck him. Let's go. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if he's just taking a quick outdoor nap in between big bounty hunting gigs, you know? So I guess Gene's sleeping on a bench near here? the bench isn't Gene. It just doesn't really make sense to me. I'm, I'm, you know, I, I was thinking you'd have like a big bounty hunting office. Uh, hello? Get away. Don't take my shit. Oh my god. I, it can't be. What do you want? Y you're not the famous bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian, are you? Wow, you look great, kid. A natural. Definitely not gonna die on your first bounty. Alright, I, I guess we'll give it a shot, but I, I don't know about this. Ah, oh, yeah, shit. It's still in trial mode. I pawned off the activation license. The ticket should be in one of your pockets. Some loose change, too. Should be enough. Take that down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop, and he'll get you all set up. The suit will help you get there. Hey there, Gene Zaruthian. It's me, Pseudo, your helpful bounty hunting assistant. Before I enable mobility, I just need to make sure your info scanner is online. Can you go ahead and give the area a quick scan for me? Okay, perfect. Great job. I've identified your current objective. Head on down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop. Can you see the waypoint? Perfecto mundo. Everything is in working order. Mobility unlocked. You are free to move, Gene. All right. I'll get things set up at your house while you're gone. Uh, okay, let's just head to Mr. Oh, oops, sorry about all those pop-ups. I forgot to warn you about that. Um, you can close them with the interact button, but they are gonna keep coming back non-stop. Uh, that's just gonna keep happening until you activate the license. Sorry, you better hurry up.
You you able to see okay? Sorry, I, I didn't expect Gene to be. What's what? up, freak? Jorb, greet the customer properly. Welcome to Mr. Keep's dipshit. We're your friendly neighborhood pie shop. Buy something or don't, nobody even cares. Jorb, I'm so sorry. Jorb is insane. Come on up to the counter. Let me help you out. Oh, so old Zaruthia doesn't feel like pawning his license key anymore. What? Did he win the sweepstakes? Ha! Okay, so you want this license key. But, but it's really nice. I kind of want it for myself. You've got enough useless shit, Dad! Fine, take it! It's yours! Okay, fuck yeah! Activation license accepted. Bounty hunting suit is in perfect working order. Time for an important question. Would you like to keep me on? as your permanent in-suit advisor. That was the best choice you could have made. All right, bye-bye now. I'll be back a bunch. Whoa, not bad. It's got your vital readings, armor levels, even my biometrics. Gene really came through, didn't he? I told you he'd be great. Perfect. Just what this galaxy needs. Another good-for-nothing bounty hunter. Out of my star! All right, bounty hunter. I guess let's head back to the house and check in with Gene. You'll find it, you'll figure it out. Hey, you can run, you know. You, you, I don't know if you do that. Try hitting the button on your screen. I, I can't say the name of the button because I have a fucking clue what kind of controller or keyboard you're using. Huh, there's, there's little guys coming out of your house. That, okay. Hey! Nice house you got here. Real ritzy. Way better than my bench. Oh, wow, you really made yourself at home, huh? Oh, there you are. Who's this weirdo, and why is he setting up a fucking huge alien computer in our living room? Okay, first of all, that alien computer is a very expensive and surprisingly operational Bounty 5000. So, uh, you're welcome. A what 5000? Your kid here thinks they're gonna be a big bad bounty hunter. I set them up with some fancy equipment, so they're letting me have the house when they die. Kid? They're not my kid. I'm their sister. How old do you think I am? Listen, hairball, I don't know what kind of alien you are or how fast you age. I'm just making my best guesses here. You were only gone five minutes, and you already told some random alien he could move in with us. That's what you did. Look, I know it's a lot all at once, but we need him to save your species, so do you think you could put up with him for a bit? Well, yeah, if it's gonna help, sure. I'm sorry, everything I've ever known just got flipped upside down, so I don't know what's weird or not anymore. Hey, I don't like getting up to take shit, so I'm just gonna shit right here in the couch later. I don't have to shit right now, but... Just a heads up. Like that. Was that weird or was that normal? It was weird, right? It was weird. Your mom's nice. Anyway. Come talk to me when you're ready to get down to business. So what, we just jump into the deep end and start hunting down G3 officers, or, or what? I'm not sure you're ready just yet. I mean, they don't let you fuck the glumpers at glumpies without a level four fuck pass, do they? Uh, what? I, I, I don't know. Well, they don't. Maybe I should send you out on a little test run first, eh? Uh, okay, sure. I've got just the thing. A small-time local gangster by the name of Nine Torg. She took my favorite knife. She's got an operation out in the slums. Maybe you kill her and get my knife back. <laughs> then we'll talk. Maybe take you out to Glumpy's to celebrate. All right, so we, we just head out to the slums? No, moron. You gotta use the Bounty 5000 to initiate a bounty. That's what I went through all the trouble of setting it up for. Okay, Jesus. Uh, so bounty hunting, huh? Are you really going to kill people? Actually, we, we've killed a couple people already, you know. And so did you. So soon we forget. Fine, I guess I'll just hang around at home and wait for you to do all your little murders. Are you mad at us or jealous? Uh, jealous? I want to kill evil aliens, too. Go ahead, don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Maybe I'll go see what the drinking age is here in space.
You gonna use the Brownie 5000 or not? I put all that work into getting it set up. Shit. Normally that door would open up a gateway to let you walk right through it. So what do we do? Calm down. The bounty's right here in Grim. You mind just... Don't forget to get my knife! We're looking for the gateway to the slums, I guess. Look, it shouldn't be too far. Listen, just follow the waypoint. That's why you're wearing that fancy suit, isn't it? I mean, it's, it's got the augmented reality thing on it, right? Citizens, I am Grim City Magistrate Clark Nugman, and I have heard your concerns. Murder rates are... Hey! Don't even think about going down to the slums. Yeah. Hey, uh, kid, uh, excuse me, can we get our, uh, uh, we need to make our way into the slums, please? No. Hold on. So you really want to get into the slums, huh? Then settle the bet for oh, us. Come on, come on. Don't, don't, don't make him answer this one. No, room. I want to know. It's fine. We'll, we'll help. Okay, great. If you saw us at the bar, which of us would you ask out? Uh, the blue guy. Exactly. That's what I figured you'd say. Yeah, everyone always says him. Hey, don't feel bad, man. You're still plenty hot. I'm just hotter. Blue's a hotter color. That's that's science. I know. I know. I know. I just I just wish one time someone would say I'm hotter. You know, I put so much work in. I watched all those skin and care tutorials, and I got surgery so I don't have to poop anymore. That's your problem. It should be effortless. Everyone can sense all that desperation, all the sadness. It just radiates. Me. I'm just true blue, all natural hot, baby. Is it true? Am I, am I just really a lost cause? Be honest. Well, hold on. We take it back. The red one's actually hotter. What? Are you fucking with me? Oh my god. Thank you. I, I am so happy. I, I, I really feel like I'm gonna cry right now. Hey, you can't change your mind like that. It's unfair, and it's also stupid because I'm way hotter. You just made a lifelong enemy, pal. Hop in and out of slums at your leisure. It's on me. I, I'm just so grateful you think I'm, I'm hotter. You know what? Please, please use my door. Use my door anytime you want. Are you serious? That is fucking amazing. Thank you. Wow. Yeah, well. I think we handled that as best we could, you know? I've never been topside. Oh, oh Lord. Is it topside? Hey, oh my God, I broke Not my interested. Oh, well. Hey, well. Hey, let's hear that. Here. You came back to talk to Slumsley. That's me, Slumsley. Look at me, I'm Slumsley. Hey, fresh meat, fresh meat, guess what? I got my GED while you were gone. I'm going to community college. Attention, Blip What's City wrong? Citizens. Fresh meat. You're wearing an army. You shot all the drones? I could have done that with my eye. Oh, no, I wasn't talking. You can just walk away. Just kidding, I was talking. You must have met my son. He calls everyone fresh meat. Thanks for not shooting him. Things have been really hard since his annoying dad got shot and killed. It's been hard because even though my annoying husband is gone, my son is still so annoying too. So go ahead and kill him if you really want to. I'm not gonna stop you. I'd love to not have any annoying family members left. You can't pass through here. It's Nine Torg's turn. Jesus, enough with everyone getting in our way. We just want to kill Nine Torg. Yeah, right. You kill Nine Torg. Get lost, shit heel. Hey, what, is that? what the fuck? Holy shit! You just killed Jason. Jason's dead. Oh shit! Here we go. We're gonna have to kill some of these Torg foot soldiers to prove ourselves around here. These people think we're weak. Not on my watch. What are you? Some kind of bounty? The slums are full, asshole. Yeah, this is not turf. turf. The coolest turf. Shit, they're shooting at us. Come on, shoot back. Come on, shoot back. It's gonna be so easy to kill you. Nine Torch trained us real good. What the fuck is that? Is the game like this? I got all this great information I could... Hello there, friend. Can I help you?
Do you know how we can get to Nine Torg? Buddy, all I know is fish, and I barely know fish. But let's just pretend there's a laundromat you can sneak through to get to Sludge Works over there. Are we pretending, or is there really a laundromat? Come on, kid, take the hint. Either we're pretending, or Nine Torg's goons kill me for squealing. Okay, I got it. We're pretending. Oh, Christ, just follow that path along the sludge. Hey, thanks for the info, uh, wise fisherman. We'll see you later. Have a good day now. Oh, hey, you want to see a cool party trick? Fuck yeah, I told you. Did you see how fun that was? I call it my glob shot. It comes out of my trick hole. All Gatlians have a different kind of trick hole. My yes! Yo! Oh God, I could do this all day. D doesn't this fucking rule? God, I love spewing big gloopy globs. We can't open those yet. We're, we're gonna need something sharp. Sanitary and, and it hurts like fuck. Shoot, I, I got an idea. It's another trick up my little slimy sleeve. Try hitting him with my glob shot. Take your time and aim. You're gonna kill us. Whoa, perfect shot. You fucking nailed it. How sick was that? Whew, okay, I gotta recharge. It doesn't take too long, but it's a little longer when there's enemies nearby. You know, my, my, my body gets too tense. It's, it's like trying to piss when someone's watching, you know? You're gonna need something like a knife to open those. They're gonna be here any minute. Just, just patient. Oi, fuck you! I'm sick of this! I wanna tear through someone's guts! Oh, I think they're talking about Gene's knife. Ah, fuck you! Got it, Reed. We've had enough of your bullshit. Uh, yeah, it's who's your there? Fault. Step who are you? Uh, hey! Hello there, friends. Oh, I, I think it's the buyer. Hey, are you the buyer? Uh, 
Uh, yeah, we're here to uh, buy buy a knife. You guys are selling a knife, yeah? Oh, perfect. You're really late. We were starting to get worried. Just go with it. No shooting. All right, here's the product. A genuine talking knife. I gotta be honest with you. He's a real piece of shit. He's extremely violent. He basically only talks about wanting to kill people in very disturbing ways. Fuck you. I'm gonna carve out your anal cavity. Gonna make it three times as big. Your shit's just gonna drop right out of there. <laughs> See what I'm talking about? Oh, uh, perfect. That's exact... Oh. Fuck yes, thank you! Pleased to meet you, I'm Knifey! Now use me, use me! Let me- Oh, fuck yes, finally! You have no idea how long oh, I've oh been thinking God. about this! I just this. the second love of my life! Let me in there! Oh, God, this feels amazing! Oh, no, oh, no, I know when I should leave! Oh, God, I'm getting out of here! Yeah, yeah, come on, get him! You know, I'm Yes, so... fuck yes! More, more, I need more stabbing! Hey, you, listen, point me at your raw, fleshy little tummy and jab me right into there! Let's get all those guts torn up! Let's see that fucking red goop spill out! I can't stop now! Oh, uh, that's a pass for us! Is this really the knife Gene was talking about? Gene? Did you just say Gene? Okay, change of plans. Bring me to Gene! So I can fucking decapitate him! Wait, what? Why? He sent us to rescue you! Oh, that's rich. There's no way I'm forgiving him, though, for leaving me with that fucking Nine Torg. He's dead to me! Huh? You know Nine Torg? We're trying to kill her! Oh, perfect! Finally, we're on the same page! Let's kill Nine Torg, then Gene! Okay, definitely Nine Torg, but l l let's put a pin in the, the whole Gene thing. H how do we get out of here? With my tether ability! I'm more than just a knife, you racist! I can tether too! Look up and latch on! Yeah, there we go! Fucking cool, right? You gotta use me to swing across this sludge! Oh, fuck yeah! Not as good as stabbing, but still pretty good! Well, all right! Where, where to next? The sludge works processing plant. Nine Torg was talking about some traitor she had to deal with. Probably another one of her clones. Five Torg or six Torg or whatever. I don't know, there's too many now. There's too many Torgs. How many clones are there? Who the fuck cares? Stop thinking so hard and just look for the big... Oh, a lug locks! Use me! I can open those fuckers up real good! And there's loot inside for you too! Win-win! Yes! that Gene gave you to Nine Torg? Hey, try gamble me away in a game of space poker. That sack of shit. Can't wait to stab all three of his fucking eyes. Even the wonky one. Especially the wonky one. Hate that one. Oh, they... oh yes! Oh, do this every time! Never fire your Gatlian again! Please, just use me for killing now. Making a knife be only any percent run. Oh, hey, there's some Gatorol. That, 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 that'll fill me back up. Come on! Whoa! Thank Jesus! Okay, feed me that Gatorol, baby. Come on, put it in my little mouth. I have some uh, That's the stuff. Oh, sludge works. Nine Torch should be here. Who's at the ready? Sometimes it, 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 it might kill. Ooh, okay. <laughs> 
I'm not sure what came over me there. I think I got caught up in the moment or something, but hey, good work, team. Let's go get Nine Torque. Any last words, Five Torque? Is that Nine Torque talking? Fuck off! I've always said you were the worst Torg. You know, Seven Torg said the same thing right before I killed her. Damn you! And you're next. You got the. Shot might be helpful, you know. Well, we're actually hitting her. Come on, admit it. We're 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 hurting you. No, fuck you. How do you feel, Bounty Hunter? I, I feel pretty good. I, I, I really didn't know if we'd be able to pull it off. All right, it's time. Time for what? Time to carve out a piece of her. I'm thinking we go with a full slab of thigh meat, but since it's your first... Oi, what are you fucking doing? The body's back there. I know it's a little gross, but we can't leave without, you know, getting some proof. Oh, God, I can't look. I can't. I can't. Can we have just taken, like, a fingernail, some spit, uh, maybe a blood sample? Yeah, sure. Could have, I guess. Hey, I'm Five Torg. Thank you for killing my evil clone. I don't mind if you mutilate her corpse, really. It's fine. You did such a good job. That was, like, off the hook. You're not gonna take over and end up being just as evil as Nine Torg, right? Oh, don't worry. Things are gonna be a lot different around here. So, no more crime then? Oh, not that different then. Technically, all of us Torgs are evil clones, so I'm still gonna do a bunch of crime. But we're cool. Huh. Far as I'm concerned, you're a friend of the Torg family and welcome here anytime. An honorary Torg. You can be 10 Torg. Now, if you'll excuse me, my day just became very full. Oh, yeah. well, hey, hey, what are you doing? You gonna be okay? 
okay if we just kind of leave you hanging up there? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, I can get down just fine. Hanging from ropes feels nice for my species. Hey, it's good for our backs. I'm, I'm actually the one who put myself here. Oh, shit, why would you go in here? What's wrong with you? Solid bounty hunting back there. I mean, I mean don't, don't don't get too cocky about it or anything, but it was pretty cool. Yeah, not bad. That was some good killing, and I'm somewhat of a killing expert, actually. I can't wait to see Gene's face when he sees we pulled this off. Let's head back up through the slums tunnel. Hey, you thought you'd be on the I don't know why that guy even bothered attacking us. I almost feel bad. aren't you? I'm not judging. I'm just, just, just observing. Oh, you're back. Hey, yeah, my leg's still very broken. S you look, you looking for a new sidekick? Welcome back to my amazing place. Time in the slums. Come visit any time. Just don't talk to me. This time making them far, far hornier than ever. However, there's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't lie. Sorry, yeah, no, he can't talk. He just sort of makes that noise. Huh, that's, uh, that's unfortunate for him. Look, it took me a while to understand what Globo's saying, but he's just saying over and over, I want a drum. Give me a drum. Somebody give me a drum. He just said he likes you, and he hopes you'll get him a drum. Why is the door closed? Who is it? You got my munch dash delivery? What? No, it's us. Oh, shit. Really? Good job. Oh, hold on. Is that Gene? Okay, get ready. I want you to stab me right into his fat little belly. What the hell, Gene? He installed new locks because he assumed you'd get killed. He keeps saying it's his house now. What? No. I just took the liberty of upgrading your security. Did you really kill Nine Talk, though? Yeah, we actually did. Well, well, well. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm really blown away. I'll be honest with you. I expected you to die. Oh, thank you. So, what did it feel like? Killing nine Torg. Look, I gotta be honest, it felt good. It felt great. I mean... Hey, Gene, lift up that shirt and expose your soft little belly for me. I'm coming in hot. Yes. Forgot how psycho he was. Why don't you just, uh, hold on to him for now? Oh, sure, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep him far away from you. Yeah, thanks. Now, uh, go turn in your bounty at the Bounty 5000. I got it all set up for you. No, seriously, let me stab him.
So, <laughs> what, you're some sort of bounty hunter now? What are you gonna save humanity? You only kill the bad guys, not the good ones. Yeah, pretty cool, right? Are you proud of your sibling here? <laughs> I mean, not really, but you, you enjoy, you enjoy. Well, there you go. You're a real bounty hunter now. Huh, would you look at that? I, I guess we're really doing it. Yeah, I didn't expect you to get your footing so quick. I don't even have any leads on any G3 bounties. You're, uh, serious about going after them, huh? You bet. Well, we'll take them all down, including Garmantuous. Well, you're welcome to try, and if you do, you might want to go to the pawn shop and buy back the Dodge unit I pawned off. Forgot to tell you about it. Go scrounge up some pesos and buy that, or whatever else tickles your fancy. I'll have some G3 bounties ready for you by the time you get back. Sure, sounds good. Thanks, Gene. Just maybe next time don't assume we're just gonna die. Right. Got it. You're really gonna need that Dodge unit from the pawn shop. The suit's not really complete without it. What, while you were off murdering a gang lord in the slums? How is it down there? Any cool shops, or is it just sort of depressing? Everyone up here just makes the slum sound really depressing. I'm probably just gonna not go down there, to be honest. But it is pretty crazy you killed a gang lord. And she was a woman, though. Not very feminist of you to kill a woman in power. Gene said you might have the old Dodge unit that goes with this bounty suit. Oh, yeah. We got that. Why? You want it? I want it, too. So it'll cost you. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, we, we know how buying stuff works. Sure, be a doll and tell the customer to stop climbing on our shelf. No, I think it's cool they're doing that. I think it kicks serious ass. the best day of your life because tomorrow all right there you go one dodge unit have a nice life all right we got it L let's try this bad boy out and then head back to gene make sure you bring that around here once in a while so i can see it again Partner, that's not for sale. <laughs> oh, sorry, partner, that's not for. Oh, sorry, partner, that. Oh, sorry, partner, that's not for sale. You go on and have the best day of your life. Cause tomorrow, it's gonna be rock bottom again! Congrats on your purchase, what a fucking cookie. God, you found the kid a drum, right? Is this for him? Can he have it? Yep. 
Yeah, here, it's yours. Enjoy. Oh, thank you so much. He is so excited and grateful. He's not gonna let you down. This was a good use of your time. Thank you so much. Well, what do you know? Fuck it, that fucker's pretty good. Okay, great. You got the Dodge unit. So how about it? Think you're ready for the big leagues, kid? What, what do you mean? The big league. The G3 cartel. That's the next step. Taking down their head officers. Okay, um, are you, are you're positive that we're ready for that? Yeah, whatever. Might, might as well try. But they won't be pushovers like Nine Torque, so, uh... Well, to be honest, I don't care if you live or die. You know that. You know my whole deal. But, uh, hey, it's your funeral. So go check out the Bounty 5000 whenever you're ready. Got two G3 leads for you right now. Krubus and Douglas. You can pick which one you want to let kill you first. There's a goddamn sandstorm going on, bunch of fucking sand in my eyes. No, you're you got a helmet on. No, I don't I don't. Oh shit, Greebles. Look look at him go. They eat up broken ship parts. Does it taste good? I no idea. I'm not I'm not about to give it a taste test. Ugh, I'm getting sand in my mouth. You fucking helmet wearing piece of shit. You can't relate to this. What do I have a helmet? You're getting me the helmet upgrade the second we're done with this shit. Distance. You know, that was the first settlement out here, pre-G3. I heard scavengers used to suck in freighters with a big magnet and loot their cargo. You know, I mean, this place is fucked, you know, Port Turin. Here we are. normal on Port Turin. You know, this asteroid's always been a lawless land, but now that the G3 set up shop, it's even worse. Like, I died. Oh, yeah, no, you can kill these guys. Nobody cares. They're just like, you know, guys to shoot. I'll be honest, I really want you to use my long shot. You know, maybe we can use that to our advantage. All right, seriously, I I'm getting sick of the desert. Can we just move on to the next bit, you know, please? Yeah, 
hey, you know, I, I'm sure this goes without saying, but the, you know, that green stuff is toxic and will da will hurt you. So don't go in it, into it. Let's get ready for supper, dear. I'll, I'll prepare the meal. All right, I can see Old Town. It's just just across this beams. bridge. And, uh, you know, I'll tell you what. Support. Whoa, 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 Wait, whoa, whoa. Guy. Hey, 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 look, walk away if you want. This is a fucking mac and cheese. Hey, don't, construction don't site. We ain't us. done here. Hey, but you gotta be careful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa hey, calm down. What the hell? How do you want to handle this? Maybe we just, you know, move past Are you them. kidding me? You think you could just walk up into a Mac and Chief Brothers construction site like you're some sort of fucking Jesus Christ and just fucking walk around like you own the place? There's a goddamn bottomless pit over here, asshole. You think you could survive that? Falling through a fucking bottomless pit down to the bottom? I don't think so. We got work to do. Okay, dipshit? Get the fuck out of here, asshole. You know? Hey, fuck you. You can kill everyone now? Well, great. You killed all the weird construction guys. You know, we're free to move along now like we were before we killed them. This. Hey, nice work. You know, it wasn't a hard thing, but ni nice work. <sighs> nice to you, ready. Move through this place and we'll we'll get to Douglas. Hey, you whippersnappers looking to get into Old Town? Howdy there, partner. Welcome to Old Town. They call me Old Wet Grundy. How can I help you? Hey, do you happen to know where we can find a a, a guy named Douglas? Douglas? The G3 fella? <laughs> oh, we. He's a rough one. Never seen somebody drink as much as him. Why, just last night, uh, nobody. I shouldn't speak out of turn. The G3 don't like that none, and I don't like them. Just head down to Dread Town. I'm sure you'll find them. And how do we get to Dread Town? It's, it's, it's been a little bit for me. Oh, that's easy. You just go through this gate, pop into Old Town, and shoot straight down the main strip. You can't miss the big Dreg Town entrance. It's a real goddamn eyesore. Wish they'd get rid of it. I'll open the gate for you. Oh, well, thanks, Grundy. That's old way, Grundy. And of course, opening the gate's my whole job. It's why I have a good time in there, yo. <laughs> Oh, there's more of them? 
Dreg Town's past here. I just stand around and tell people, hey, I, I can't let anyone in right now. There's too many recruits causing trouble in town. I get in trouble when that happens, so I'm gonna keep the gate locked until they stop or get killed. Wink, wink. Are you telling us to kill them? Whoa, I didn't say that. I just said wink, wink, and okay, yeah, that's what I meant. So go kill them and, and I'll let you through. I know what the afterlife is like. I died. <laughs> More drunk for crew. feeling that there's probably some more G3 causing trouble, you know, somewhere around town. We, we should we should maybe de deal with it. Joined up with the bad guys. Oh, shit, more G three causing trouble. Anyways, uh, l l l l let's, uh, let's poke our way into Dregtown now. Let's go to Dregtown. Thank you so much for saving me. Oh, my God. Thank you. Uh, but you know what? I kind of, I'm kind of thinking I would have fucked him. So now I, I don't know. I'm going to go think about that. See you later.
did it! The town's all cleaned up! I keep tab to I don't know how many times I've told the recruits not to cause trouble out there or if someone's gonna kill them. You told us to kill Tomatoes, them! Tomatoes, potatoes. I'm just a dumb gate guard. Whatever, head on through. Right there. Uh, that's how you know we're in the right spot. Okay, Douglas again. This ad is about the torture. Uh, the last one was about joining the. Helen is part of the Mothers Against Violence. So, no violence allowed. Wow, so this is what a G3 run city looks like. Anyway, yeah, I'm excited to join the G3, but I'm gonna miss my wife and six kids. Oh, yeah. I had mine killed before I left, so I wouldn't feel bad. Wow, that's so smart. I'll do that too. I'm gonna kill my wife and kids so I don't miss them. So, like I was saying, my brother told me Douglas is really into torture. Like another batch of oh, I hope we don't have to meet Douglas. Damn, can you believe they built all this on the bottom of an asteroid? I, I mean, I, I, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's a good place to hide out, I mean, but yeah. Oh, look at that, look at that, they got, they're, they're fucking dealing with some Greebles over there, dumb fucks. Okay, shit, I, I guess let's just kill them all. G3 training facility. Maybe Douglas does the training in person. Hey, hey, you can trust me. He's fine. I'm trustworthy, I promise. Hey, hey there. Thanks for coming over here. I'm the goop guy around these parts. You wanna sneak in the G3 facilities? You gotta get covered in goop. That's just how it goes. My stuff's quality. So you, you want some goop, right? You know what? Yes. How about how about a big fat yes? Let's go. Perfect. Head down the alley there and just uh, let the magic happen. I guess. Uh, don't don't worry. First goop's on me. Just tell all your buddies about it. I'm the goop guy. I do goop stuff. Oh! Oh! This fucking. 
fucking oh my god the smell oh my god i'm gonna fucking throw up okay, okay. hey look at you you're all gooped up i gotta be honest it won't last long it's not the real stuff so you better be quick get in get out don't stay in there too long don't lull me gang okay douglas again this ad is about the torture uh, the last one was about joining the g3 but this one is about how i love here we got another gooped up G3 recruit. Be advised that the G3 cartel is not responsible for any life-threatening injuries you may incur on these premises. But even if we were, we wouldn't give a shit. Who cares? I hope you get shot. Good luck. Uh, thanks. Are you fucking kidding me? They have some whole thing prepared? Shut the fuck up, it's starting. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm sure you already know who I am, but for anyone living under a rock, I'm Douglas, G3 Chief of Training and Torture. And wouldn't you know it, I like to blur those lines a little. Training? Torture? What's the difference, I say? Look to your left. Now look to your right. Both of those people are gonna die today. You are about to jump right into an accurate warp-based simulation of what it'll look like to be on the real battlefield. And let me tell you, you're probably gonna die. But hey, if you don't, you get to join the G3. Big whoop. All right, that's it. Lock and load, fuckers. Oh my god, is that... Right, shut you it saw off. that, right? I got Dude, torture that was a to Gatlian. do. Douglas has a Gatlian. We, we, we got a rescuer. Jesus, these fucking Merkeloids. Oh, fuck, here we go. Oh, I, here we shit, go. I hope it's not too difficult. How many of these assholes do they have? Nipulon, Duck. Right, that's, that's the last of them, right? Oh, okay, you beat all the weak guys. Easy, really easy. Now go do the obstacle course. Oh, okay. I'm doing it. I'm really doing it. Okay, you know what? It looks like some simple platforming, you know, like what you'd see in like Lucky's Tail on, uh, you know, or um, you know that one uh, that one game that we that we all know and love, Mario. Really? You got hurt? That that looked like it should have been easy. Stop messing up! Oh God, uh, I have a pacemaker. One zap would kill me. My dick! Okay, l let's just get this over with, please. Well, I guess it's apparently harder than it looks. Careful! Oh. You know, uh, listen, uh, you're not gonna impress me if you if you if you get through this. It's, it's pretty simple. Fucking that fucking jump! God damn! That was a little that, that we, we made it. it was a little tough heads. though. So you made it past the first training exercise. Big deal. That one was easy. We lied and said it was hard to scare you. Oh, it's fun to freak you out, to fuck with your heads. Now get ready for exercise two. It starts in one hour. That's right, you have to wait a full hour. We're testing your resolve. So just stand there patiently and wait. Then this door will open and you can continue. Uh, okay, there's no way we're waiting a full hour. Okay, thank God. Okay, let, let's ditch this whole recruiting bullshit thing. Oh shit, that's Gatorol. Fe feed me some of that. It gives me more energy. It gives me energy back to do more cool shit. Oh shit, okay. Well, there goes that bootleg goop. Uh, I guess that didn't last for very long. Oh my god, hello! 
Oh, thank God you're here. My name's Dr. Jupy. Douglas kidnapped my whole family, and I'm trying to sneak in and save them. But I just can't get through these pipes in the next room. Oh, my God, I'm freaking out. Hey, whoa, whoa, l listen, little guy. We're trying to find Douglas, too. You know, maybe we can help each other. God, I'm so worried I'm gonna, gonna throw up. You really helped me? Oh, gee, I'm, I'm so grateful. Follow me. <laughs> You gotta connect these pipes for me, so I can get through and save my family. Hey, don't worry. This is a classic textbook puzzle situation. I think me... Wow! You did it! You got the door open! Listen, I'll never forget this. You're my personal hero. Oh, come on. You're too... you're too kind. It, it was easy. Who? Did you say you're heading to find Douglas too? His office is that big building up on top of Dregtown. Uh, there's a zip line just past here that'll take you right to him. Huh. Well, all right then. I, I, I hope the guy gets his family back. Oh. All right, Douglas, here we come. That was the hardest part behind us. This is basically done. We finished this shit. We are fully finished. What is this? Congratulations to all of you worms who made it this far in your training. It is now time for the final test. A bloody free-for-all. Last one standing gets to join the G3. No rules, just killing. Good luck, shit heels. God damn it, another fucking thing with this. Congratulations, recruit. Now, uh, I don't know, fight some more guys. Too easy. Good job, congratulations, recruit. Now, uh, I don't know, fight some more guys.
Congratulations, graduates on joining the G3 or whatever. I really can't stress enough how little I give a shit. Now report to your commanding officer and we'll send you off to die fighting for us on whatever dumbass planet we decide. See ya. Glad to see you. I'm so happy we keep running into each other. Oh, look who it's her old friend, Dr. Jupy. What are you talking about? How wh how's it going? Uh, there's another locked door. I'm running out of time. God, I'm so worried about my kids. And a little bit about my wife, but mostly my kids. Okay, well, we'll, we'll see what we can do. Oh, poor kids. I hope Dr. doesn't kill them. I can feel my wife plenty calling for me. You're gonna solve this one too. Thank you. Swoopy and Froopy would really like you too. Oh, they're good kids. I can't wait to introduce them to you and tell them about everything you did for me. They need good, strong role models. This isn't torturing them right now. <laughs> amazing! Amazing! You did it again! Douglas's office isn't too far from here. I'm going on ahead. I'll see you there! Jesus Christ, Douglas is gonna kill Dr. Jupy. Look at look how weak and, and cute Dr. Jupy is. Forget about it. Whoops! This is an urgent announcement. This sector has temporarily been designated as a mother's floor and against violent zone. That means there's problems. You know what? That looks like Douglas's office, but we can't get in that way. Maybe we can go around back.
listen to you? You know, I, I, I guess I don't. I don't know. It's I, I, I'm I, I'm I'm conflicted on it. It's rough. Choopy, you're still alive! <gasps> oh, my best friends! This is it. Douglas is right beyond this door. Can you help me out one last time? Yeah, let's do this! Oh, huzzah! Plimmy, Froopy, Sloopy, here I come! Here I come. Oh, you're so good at these. I wish I was as good at these as you. Did you go to public school? This is a hard one. P please hurry up, my family could be dying! I'm really, really trying not to think about my wife's body being ripped in half by one of Douglas's torture devices, and it's not working, to be honest! decided that if my family is dead, I'm going to kill myself and join them in the afterlife. Don't talk me out of it. This is what love does to a person. Don't feel bad. Okay, I know that earlier I said, don't feel bad if this puzzle takes a while, but I also want you to remember, every second you take solving this is another second Douglas might be torturing and killing my family!
team. <laughs> you fell for it, idiots. Thank God. Do you know how hard it is to solve a fucking puzzle with a hangover? Well, shit. D does that mean he's... Huh? I, I feel pretty stupid right about now. <laughs> Oh, fuck off! Ha ha ha! I was never Dr. Jupy! There is no Dr. Jupy! Are you shocked, you idiot? You complete fucking moron! Oh, of course you are! Ha 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 ha! you never once suspected you're a little friend, Dr. Jupy! People like you, they get killed by smart shit! Me! You know what? Let's get this shit! This is perfect! We're, we're, we're here! You deal with my trade recruits, who are also my torture victims! Yes! They serve us! Here I go! trying to get me all excited and withhold the big clock. Ah, fuck yeah, that's definitely the stuff. Oh, now that felt good. He had some very nice, choppable flesh, actually. It was actually very nice. Oh, fuck! All right. 
right, dipshit, let's go. What? No hello? Nice to meet you? Or thank you for saving me? Why? Like you not dying there with some sort of favor to me? Hi, I'm Sweetie. Thanks so much for rescuing me. How is that, dipshit? Now come on. Pretty cool, right? You're gonna find out real fast that I'm the best galleon. Smartest, most useful, best looking. No, no, come on, come on. I'm pretty good. Douglas, it's Garmentuous. Where the fuck are you? I heard you made a hey, complete you fool of yourself at that party it's last ready. night. Not good, Douglas. Not good. I'm gonna need you on top of your game now that we've got a hold of these humans. Time We're spread time thin over on Earth, and I need more troops immediately. Not to mention things are gonna start heating up all over the galaxy as demand goes up. Big things are happening, My Douglas. Ready to get blow. excited and get your fucking shit together. Okay, yeah, fuck that. Oh god, I hope nobody comes up and shoots at me. You know, I hope nobody do want any of these guys up. this time bubble can do great perfect now hurry and cross before it wears off incredible right what a thrill you know you can use that time bubble on the g3 too and try loading the bubble up with my crystal then you'll see why i'm the best gatlian <sighs> we're gonna make a good team i can feel it just listen to everything I say and never use the other Gatlians. There we go, got a weapon for ya. So what's next? You turn in the bounty somewhere? Go do that. We can wrap this up. You think I'm supposed to be impressed that you killed a G3 officer? Y well, okay, yeah, fine. I am. I think it's pretty insane you didn't die. That's all you're getting out of me. Now, turn that bounty in. Don't you have something better to do than stand around blocking the TV all day? Who's that with you? Did you get a new Gatlin? Yeah, the name's Sweezy. Get used to it, you old fuck. Hey. You gonna turn in that bounty or just loiter in my living room? Yeah, sorry, your living room. For now. Oh, hey, another girl on the team. Good. Actually, I mean it. I'm not being snarky. That's so nice to see. Yeah, yeah, don't get too excited. We're not even the same species. There we go. Look at you. You're getting the hang of this bounty hunter thing already. How'd the mission go? They killed a G3. Looks like I taught them well. Wow. Really? Whoa. Okay. Well, I'm impressed. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was always hoping you'd find your calling. I just I didn't think it would be bounty hunting. But then again, I don't know what I thought it would be. 
maybe hairstyling and not good at it. And what's wrong with bounty hunting? Ugh, can you please tell this dried up sack of shit to go home? I don't want to share a couch with him. Tough titties, Leslie. You're kidding me had a deal. It's Lizzie! And that's not my kid. Jesus, we're siblings. Sorry, I don't know how your species works yet. Sibling, fine, got it. Doesn't change a thing. I live here now. Come on, can't he find his own place to stay? Hey, that's not right. I'm barely taking up any space. You know we had a deal fair and square. Oh, good. For a minute there, I was scared you were gonna side with him. Okay, I'll get out of your hair. And I'll just take all my nice bounty hunting equipment with me, too. You'll have to give me that suit back as well. And we'll just hope someone else comes along to stop the G3. Yeah, that's what I thought. This is a good thing we got going here. You should all be happy, both of you. You and your mom. Oh, now I know you're doing this on purpose. I'm the sister, not the mom. But you knew that, didn't you? Sorry, my bad. You come waltzing back in here stinking like dirty Flimborg, of course I'm gonna get distracted. You shouldn't be hanging out with that Flimborg boy, you know? Can't trust that species. Tweak's harmless and nice. You're being spacist. And he's not my boyfriend. Yet. Trust me, Flimborg's are bad news. Come on, have my back here. Okay, yeah, you got me there. Thank you! God, I just don't think I can take much more of this guy! What, you think this is easy for me? If I'm pissing you off, at least you can leave. But my legs don't work. I'm stuck listening to your boy trouble every time I'm trying to watch my stories. I can't even get peace and quiet in my own home because there's an alien cripple jerking off on my couch 24-7. Hey, c come on! That's a high estimate! Ew! I was kidding. Yeah, me too. I was kidding. We all know I was kidding. Aren't you gonna say anything? Whose side are you on anyway? Hey, uh, all right. I, I, I can see I'm being a little bit of a bother. I mean, look, I'll, I'll try to keep it down when I'm uh, watching my stories. Just don't uh, put me back on the streets. <laughs> I really do want to help you. Fine, he can stay. But only until he finds somewhere else to go. I'm grateful. I mean it. But I've already missed half my program, so can everyone just shut the hell up? Ugh. All right, that's enough excitement for one day. You got more bounties to get to, kid. And you might want to check out the pawn shop to see what you can spend your new payout on, eh? Mm. Right. Oof, that was tense. It's times like these I'm, I'm almost relieved I don't have any family left alive. But, but not really. I, I miss them a lot. Hey, uh, just so you know, you can use the Bounty 5000 to revisit any planet you've been before. There's portal doors all over. You can just uh, use them whenever and grind for money, look for loot you miss, whatever. Up to you. Just thought I'd tell you. Muggy, and there's G3 freaks everywhere. Let's just pop Krubus and scram. Howdy! 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 A G3 Gretton! He'll tell the others, blast that sucker! Ugh, this heat. Nature sucks. The G3 does a lot of shitty things, but tearing apart this jungle ain't fucking AT watching the life drain from their beady little eyes. Oh, I bet... Yuck, spread and wide open like that? Disgusting. Okay, actually now that I'm looking at it, it's not so bad. Let's get out. 
out of the sun for a bit. Let's get dark. Let's dark it up. Check it out, a Fergal den. You thought you were the... Damn, I admire your bloodlust, but I don't want to hurt these guys. Save it for the G3. All right, keep an eye out. If there's Fergals, there's probably G3 nearby. Oh shit, okay, G3 are warping in. You ready to fight? You need to pack up. If only they were all this week, you know? Try one. Oh, look at him go. Uh, crossing my antenna for something good here. Well, looks like the G3 took over this village. I bet if we clean up the garbage and save this place, we can get the locals on our side. Jesus. 
like we saved the tribe of whatever these freaks are. That's good, I guess. Uh, you're welcome? Welcome, well. We are Moplets, Hello. native to this you. planet. My people were enslaved by the G3 and forced to desecrate the land mining for Fergals. You may have freed this small tribe, but our brethren underground are still being worked to death by Krubus. Did you say Krubus? We're trying to kill that fucker. What's this? You aim to take down Krubus of the G3? You are truly a hero to Moplets everywhere. All right, enough talk. Just tell us where we can find him so we can blow his brains out. Hmm, that's difficult to answer. His work, though evil, keeps him very busy. He oversees many different mines across Zephyr, and it's impossible to predict where he may be on any given day. My liege, what about the man in the mansion? Ah, of course, a brilliant plan. My advisor is right. There's a man nearby who knows Krubus and has access to a warp device. We may be able to use him. He lives in a mansion across the river. If you could get your hands on his warp device, that could be very useful. All right, whatever. We'll go hit up that mansion guy. Yes, he would appear to be our best chance. Godspeed, Savior. All right, enough talk. <laughs> Looky here, someone warped us in a little bridge. You're the one who fucked up the coordinates. How are we gonna get this thing out of the river? I fucked them up. I just typed in what you told me to type in. Yeah, and you typed it in wrong, dickhead! Now we're flooding! Oh, sure. It's always my fault. You know what? I have to retreat. Hey, fuck you! Yeah, fuck you! Somewhere else, we're busy. Oh, I never wanted to be. 
Check out this mansion. How much do you think it costs to maintain a place like this, you know? Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, hey, you made it. You got my fresh Fergals? What? Yeah, this is the guy we're looking for. Huh, I don't see a warp device on you. Oh, come on, is Krubus making you hoof it around on foot? Oh, that cheapskate bastard. Same old Krubus. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Here, I got an extra. Don't let anyone ever tell you Ranchi's not a generous fella, okay? There's an unused warp disk in there, too. You know, warp in whatever's on there. I don't care. It's free of charge. There's a river near here. You can probably cross with it. Oh, man, go nuts. <laughs> you warpaholics. <laughs> wow, th thank you. Hey, hey, come, 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 come. Hey, come here, come here, come here. Lean in close. Get close to me, man. I'm sure Krubus told you I'm here on Zephyr to break ground on a new Delarmo land resort? Yeah, I'm that ranchy Delarmo, CEO, Delarmo Industries. This one's gonna be even better than the one on Glassport 12. Trust me, man. That guy's busy as shit, always hopping from site to site. He's got like 30 different mines all across Zephyr. You think I can keep track of that? Fuck. I see him when I see him, okay? I, I wish you'd take some time off, though. Hey, I want to talk to him about Delarmo land. I, I'm sure you've been to Delarmo Land before, probably the flagship Glashborg 12 location, but buddy, you would not believe the regulations we had to abide by over there. Real motherfucking sticklers. So I had a Krubus, you know, make a deal with the G3, and now we're setting up a brand new location here on Zephyr where ain't nobody gonna breathe down our necks about safety protocols or background checks on all the performers. <laughs> and you're probably wondering why nothing's been built yet. Well, I might have got a little bit sidetracked 
Drawing up blueprints takes a lot out of me, you know? So I unwind with a little Fergal or two. Sue me. But we're making good progress, yeah? Or will be soon. Another thing. Check out the scale model of the new Delarmo land, because <laughs> it's got a lot of detail. <laughs> it's going to be the planet's only all-inclusive pansexual drug bazaar. On the beach, you can get your rocks off while getting your surf on. And I can have all the Fergals I want. That's just a perk on top of a rock-solid development plan. And once I stop enjoying the perk, I'll get right back to planning this resort any day now, as soon as I've had my fill of the Fergals. Oh, man, Krubus. <laughs> what a guy. You see that photo over there? That's the snap of me and the Krub, man. That shit was like, I don't know, 20 years ago, man? That's how long we've known each other. He used to be a real wild man before he turned into such a frickin' stodger, you know? Mm, I got clean. Mm, I got sober. <laughs> All paperwork and shift management. I mean, crew man, you work for the space mafia. You'd think you'd still have a little fun every now and then. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sweating. <laughs> I am sweating so hard right now. Sorry for all the rambling. Uh, what are you still doing here? Look, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm totally fucking joking. How much over money here. does this huh? guy have? Not and I'm not, I'm, I'm not saying that because of this. So really? I don't smell anything. It smells easy. just fine in here. <laughs> All right, okay, we got a warp device. Um, you know, that's gonna be helpful. Why don't we use it to cross this river so we can go talk to the Moplets and check in with them? Huh, we might be able to open that from the other side. Looks like they're working on fixing this portal. You know, hey, maybe we can use it later, you know? Okay, uh, let's use this warp device Ranchy gave us to cross the river, huh? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. I'm back. Uh, looks like you're trying to use... There's that new warp device you just got. You want me to help you out? Yeah, that guy has serious problems, but he gave us this warp device. By the gods, you've done it! You got the warp device! This might actually work. You continue to provide us with hope, Grand Savior. With this warp device, you can warp Krubus directly to you. How fortuitous! But alas, you'll need his coordinates and a blank warp disk to encode them onto. Hmm. Oh well, no way you're getting those. That stuff's in the mines. We could just go down there and get it right now. Oh right. Take this access code and head down to the mines. 
Everything you need is there. Okay, perfect. Thank you. You know, you, you guys figured out that whole plan for us. You know, that really means a lot. You know, it clears things up for, for us, you know, anyway. Yep, uh, we'll, we'll get it done. Please do not let us down. All right, jeez, don't make us nervous. All right, let's use the passcode and get in. Nice. Jeez, are the G3 even trying to domesticate the local mites? Holy shit, looks like the G3 ran into trouble. All right, maybe they'll sort this out themselves. Die, you creepy crawly bastard. Fuck this place up. I didn't know it had gotten this bad. These guys just don't let up, do they? Oh shit, Grinkins. Gotta be honest, uh, you know, they're, they're working with the G3, but it's still better than our friend from earlier. Promising. Wanna ride this bad boy deep? So this is their Fergal mining operation? God damn! Look how much work they put into destroying an entire planet. Well, guess this is our stop. Took you long enough 
to use me again, Jesus! Alright, don't forget, we're looking for a blank warp ticket and some way to find out where Chris is. It. Get to work. take any breaks thank you I wonder what the G3 are gonna use that money for I hope you enjoy your purchase the G3 Attention, mining operation 12C. It's me, Krubus. Speed things up! I'm fucking underwater here trying to keep things on schedule. And I figured maybe you forgot that if you piss me off, I will kill you. It's really easy to find more slaves. Look, just do your job and mine more Virgos. Krubus out. Holy shit. Hey, he's got a Gatlion. We, we gotta rescue it. Operation 12C, this is Krubus again. One of you weird moblet fucks just delivered me a batch of defective Virgos. You wanna know how I know they're defective? Because they're fucking dead! Looks like most of them got crushed in a cave-in. And I punished the moblets responsible, but it looks like they died in the cave-in too. Okay, yeah, there's no way we're getting past that laser grid. There's gotta be some some way to shut it off somewhere around here. Operation 12C. This is Krubus again. Yeah, I tried mining for a bit, but you know, my rip. They're trying to be, you know, so they get scrapped right away. You know, as soon as that happens, and I've got the whole time. I kept accidentally re-snapping my rip over and over again. What's up, fuckers? It's me, Krubus again. Someone filled out the wrong shipping destination on an entire stack of Form 40 cubes. You fucked up my whole day when you did that. Just come for it and tell me whose fault it was. I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you! Again, just bored this time. I've been staring at the paper all fucking day, and my brain's melting. I, I fucking hate. Oh fuck yeah! Why the fuck does God Matthew always stick me with the paperwork? Doesn't he know I have fuck? 
That means I should be drilling. And for another, it means I, I, I keep shredding all this important fucking pa No, I don't know what they look like. What uh, excuse me? For... I've got to go. We'll talk more later. Bye, Merle. I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. I'm Helen. I just need to know, are you the new hire or the new boss? Fuck yeah, I'm the new boss. Do I look like a wage slave to you? Let me in, I'm ready to boss people around. Wow, impressive. I'm inspired already. Head on through those doors and don't be afraid to get tough. These new guys really need some strong leadership. All right, listen up, you maggots. Sweezy's the new boss in town and you all gotta do what I say. I'm gonna whip your shit into shape. Any questions? No, ma'am. No, no, no ma'am. Uh, we were just filing paperwork. Oh, just, just tell us what you want us to do, ma'am. Kiss each other on the mouths! What the fuck? You want us to kiss each other? Yeah, on the fucking mouths! With tongue! I actually can't do this, because I'm, um, I'm married. That's a shame. I always thought you were really hot. Yeah, me too. Oh my god, whoa, do you, do you mean it? Of course! Look at you! Have you even seen your ass? You have a perfect ass, Dimitri. Thank you, yeah, I, I agree, I have a very perfect ass. Now, uh, come, o come over here. Alright, that's enough. Really hot stuff, but enough. Now, what's next? Everyone fight each other! Do we have to? Yes. Uh, fine. Oh! That really hurt! Hey, whoa, whoa, what are you doing? You, you can't just hit them like that. Get your hands off of me! Okay, how was that? Very good. Thank you. Now, let's see. What's next? Fire each other! Um, what? I need this job. Too bad, you're fired. Pack your shit and get out. You're, you're fired too. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Wait, guys, you don't have to fire each other. We don't have to do everything she says. Yeah, we do. If we don't do it, she'll fire us. All right. You're fired. Pack your shit and get out. All right. Sick. That was fun. Now let's see if we can find out where Krubus is. Fuck. Krubus's office really looks like shit. Let's find what we need in bail. Krubus, where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days behind schedule with the latest shipment. But you know what? It's not that big of a fucking deal. These Fergals aren't gonna be worth shit now that we discovered humans. Might even have to shut this whole operation down just to get all hands on deck over on Earth. I'd give your territory to the Scrandle Brothers and have them expand their facilities to find out more about these humans. Oh, have you tried one of these fuckers yet? Oh, God, the high? It's otherworldly. Can't believe a species like this really exists. Humans! <laughs> Who'd have even thought? Anyway, don't fuck up again, even if it doesn't matter, or I'll smoke you myself. Here we go. Fucking bingo. This idiot left a paper trail. Four day the 12th. That's today. We fucking got him. Okay, so what? We just need the blank warp disk now? Easy peasy.
And for another, it means I, I keep shredding all this important fucking paperwork! Quick! Use me to shoot yourself in the head so you don't die of poison! What's going on? Ah, don't, don't get me in trouble. No, no, it's oh. okay. We're friends. We, we hate the G3, too. Oh, wonderful. Thank God. Oh. Listen, we're looking for a blank warp disk. Do, do you have any ideas? Ah, uh, yes. Our prince has a stash of them. Really? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped on in our holy land. Then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rescue Prince Chosen One. And then he'll give us a blank disc? Yes, oh yes, we can, we can help each other. Oh, what a fortuitous happenstance. Oh. <clears throat> Is his name really Prince Chosen One? Yes. He was named as such according to the prophecy. <sighs> and then after that, it was made into a prince. So you trust your leaders to prophecies. Is he a good prince? Well, the prophecy doesn't guarantee he's gonna be good at his job. It just tells us who to pick. Look, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Look, if now is not the time to criticize us. We're, I'm just, you know, we're distressed as it is. I'm just doing my job. So, what's your plan? We have started a resistance. Oh. Not only do the G3 enslave us, but they have desecrated our holiest of sites oh. and absconded with our sweet prince. Prince Chosen One. That's, that's him. Prince Chosen One. Oh, that's <laughs> awful. So, so you kidnapped this G3 merc as a bargaining chip to get your prince back? Oh, hmm. Yeah, that's smart. No, we, we didn't think of that at all. But it's fine, we know where the prince is. They swapped him out with the rest of our sacred grounds when they warped in a new base. So you want us to go clear it out and then warp the throne room back? Oh, heavens! Would you really do all that for us? The base is just past this tunnel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, we are off! <laughs> Oh shit, this must be the place! Okay, let's clear it out! Let's head back outside and use this to reverse the warp. Maybe you could be a little grateful? Saved me from what? I'm fine. Look, we were told you had some sort of blank warp disc. Huh? Yeah, 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 sure. I've got a bunch. Okay, we got everything we need. Let's get back to Ranchi's place and see if he, you know, can help us encode them onto this machine. Prince Chosen One has returned. All has been restored. This is the Prince Chosen One you were talking about, right? Yes. Isn't he incredible? And also really hot. Uh... Mom! Where's my mom? I'm hungry! I want the bowl of the garden! Prince Chosen One, I'm
Let's let's head inside. Hey, uh, you're back. Uh, All right, looks like it's working. Uh, did you bring my Fergal? Uh, I need a bed. Uh, I need my fix, kid. Uh, I need a bed. I need it. All right, there we go. Time to warp in Krubus and then you know kill him if 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 we're able to. You ready? Oh Jesus! Hey, I've got a crazy idea. What if we just swap out this mansion for Krubus's base? Who the fuck are you? We'll all be damned. We found Krubus officially. Hey, come down here, asshole! No! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey! Where you going? Jack off! How dark it is! Glumps off there, wasn't I? Sorry about that. Ooh. Hey, 
bud. The name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out Krubus like that. Rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc., etc. I love that kind of stuff. You know what? I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping you'd say. We can use your help. But I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel, and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? Buddy, that's all I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing, God, I'm so glad to find another Catlian alive and well. I love your tiny little hands, by the way. I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Catalyst, but, you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know what? Uh, hey, you're not supposed to be down here. No, 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 don't shoot this guy. Let me show you what else Papa Gus can do. Fuck, whoa, what the Here fuck? it comes! Pretty chill, right? Use that whenever you want. It's cool! <laughs> and I see another wall you can climb. You see that, right? Hmm, still a little far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that one. Oh, hey! It's me, Quentin the Finally! Enough of that guy. They kicked him out of the G3 because he was so damn annoying. He's lonely, he's bitter, and get a life. Some people need a life, and he needed a life, man. Freedom, baby. I already felt free when you saved me from Krubus. But now that we're out of the pit, I really feel free. Show your face, bounty hunter. You having a good time, partner? I am. Let's head home and turn in this bounty. Hey, kid. Another one down, huh? Great work. But, uh, hey, there's something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. But oh well. Us humans are dumb yeah, who's that green fella you got there? What's up? I'm Gus. It's good to meet you. Come on, turn in that bounty already. I gotta show you this. All right, good. Get over here. Check this out. Hello, Blim City citizen. That's Club Nugman, Blim City magistrate. Working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. All right, all right. Now catch us next bit. All about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you. They've already dealt with two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. I mean, we might as well hear him out, right? I already told him you go. Without even asking us first? No, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Head through there. Clug's expecting you. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. Our pleasure. Nice view you got up here. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Yeah, they're a human. We're Gatlians. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces. But perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? A lawless bounty hunter teaming up with a squeaky clean politician. <laughs> really? That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you, you've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but 
There's also one way I can help you. Go on, let me take it all in. This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Let me get this straight. You're giving this to us for free. Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. That's right. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. We appreciate that, pal. If it's okay if I call you pal. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. Uh, feel free to stay as long as you'd like. Hi! Look at us! Hi. And we're back! So, <laughs> it went well, huh? Yeah. I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yeah, and he hooked us up with a way to save humans! God damn! You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of... We should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Bordo's chef stand, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You want it come or what? You sell alien cum? Why the fuck do you do that, man? I know it's gross, but calm down. My name is Stan, and I sell horrendous amounts of all sorts of alien cum, and we're just gonna have to live with that knowledge together now. Let's have some cum. I try anything <laughs> Whoa, look at you. You want some alien cum. I'm so glad you're interested. Look, you caught me on a good day. I'm doing a promo one time off of free alien cum. Take some on the house, and if you like it, just come back and get some more. Just tell all your friends about me. Say Stan has the absolute best alien cum I've ever seen, tasted, touched, whatever. I'm not sure if it's his or if he's getting it from some other alien, but I'm just such a huge fan of his work and what he's doing out there on the streets of Blim City selling alien cum to the community. Say all of that. Ah, looking for more alien cum, are you? Well, I'm sorry. I'm fresh out of alien cum right now. We sell out early sometimes. I gotta go restock my supply, and that's not so easy, trust me. But give me a little bit and I'll have plenty more. I promise. I just, I just need some recovery time. If you touch me again, I'll flip out! We're looking for a jetpack. A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Ah, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Cool, so where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final! Well, I was really kinda hoping we would get it right away. How, uh, 
Oh god, I can't believe I'm starting a conversation with Jor, but uh, how's school, Jor? Ain't none of your business, dipshit. Oh, come on now. Is that so wrong that I want to know more about my son's life? Fine, you want to know how school is? You really want to know what your son did today? We had to dissect some baby Swedes in biology class, and I named mine after you, father. I said this little... Great! Now get out of here. Oh, sorry, partner. The... It's not for sale. Good eye. Oh, hey, get your hands off. That's not for sale. Oh, hey, get your hands off. That's not for sale. You know, Jorf, I don't think you're very nice to me. Ah, oh, that's fine. I'm okay with that. Well, it's not fine for me. I'd like to see, just for one second, a little respect out of you for your father. You understand? Just thanks. Yeah, you understand. Ain't, ain't giving this stuff up. I think you'll be happy with that. Portaling your item to the baggage area now. Good eye. That thing's a real beauty. Oh, hey, get your head. Come back. there. You the owner of this house? It can't be here. Gotta give you a ticket. So you gonna go to the party this weekend? How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but it's on back order. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? Gene's right. That, that's, that sounds like a good idea. Place, I don't know. This place is cool. They gave us free air massages. Yeah, I keep telling them it's not really something that humans like, but they keep offering them, so I keep taking them. We get 12 full meals a day. None of us have the heart to tell them we don't need to eat that much. The oh, toilets so here are just out in the open. Straight. No like dividers. Yep. Oh, yeah. But yeah, honestly, we all got used to it real oh, yeah, quick. Same. Now it's I a like fun it here thing. Like, hey, more. Toby's taking a sh-
Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. No, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry. I'm, I, I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. Let, let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all of space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Partner, let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Holy shit, this rules! All the time. Nice! That's fine. So don't elect it. Damn, you're just like a TonyHawk.com jetpack pro. Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You can fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. Before Tweet gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck off, Gene. Like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fucked more aliens than your brain could comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot, though, right? Wait, you haven't even met him. Why are you calling him gross? You know I've got a whole life going on here. While well, you're off having fun, doing whatever it is you do. No, you're right. Her boyfriend's ugly. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great! Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed-up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, look. We've spent all this time living together. I... I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. We're all living under the same roof, and that makes us family. And it makes her business my business. I'm the man of the house, so she needs to do what I say. And before anyone accuses me of being a misogynist, yeah, I know I'm a misogynist. We all know I'm a misogynist. That's bad, and I'm working on it. But this is about me being right and your sister being wrong. Listen to yourself. I can make my own decisions. I don't know why you think you're suddenly some father figure to me just because you're crashing on my couch and eating my diary. Oh yeah, I said eating. He's been eating pages out of my diary. So what? My species eats paper, it's delicious. Who gives a shit? I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off. Just grow up and get used to me and Twig. Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. Thank you. Not that I needed your approval. Oh, fine, yeah. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't know you were depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. Just clean up, Gene, okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. 
Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Klug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. Okay, well, no guarantees we're gonna save them again, but wh wh where are they? They're working at Screndo Labs now, just past the Mushroom Valley here. Just be careful, that place is freaky. Thanks!
Hello? Is someone? Is someone? Sorry, I'm in the John. Hold, hold on, don't, don't pass through here. I've got to make you signs and forms. Just one sec. Yeah, I wasn't feeling that either. Zipline to cross? So, uh, you know, what, what do you think Scrandal Labs is like? I, I, I mean, like, I, I, I know a little bit. I mean, I, I, I heard a bit, so, so I kind of know. But I, I'm just making small talk right now. You know, I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to fill the dead air. It's really uncomfortable. I mean, don't get mad at me if what I'm saying isn't that interesting because, you know, I'm, I'm doing my best here, you know? Hello, and welcome to Scrandall. You're the bounty hunter who stepped up and took charge in the office and killed my boss, Krubus. Very unorthodox leadership style, but you got results. Anyway, sorry, I need to let the G3 know you're here. Just my job, nothing personal. Feel free to have some candy. You're uh, gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. G3 are coming for you. Sorry. It's my job. And I don't care about you. 
Oh shit, here they come. You know, hey, at least the elevators are working now. trespassing. See what kind of weird experiments they're doing in here. Would you like to do the honors? We're going to try to show up those cocky nerds in the weapons lab by fusing this human with some other aliens. Just hit the button. So you just let anybody come in here and help with experiments? That wasn't supposed to happen. You hit the button. It's on you. That was on you. No, no, no. Don't like this. Don't like this at all. Nope. This is not right. You know, this must be rough to see, Bounty Hunter. I'm so sorry, bud. Maybe that guy was really evil and deserved to die. You think of that? Fucking mess in here. Now, this is exactly what I was expecting. 
Hello, Johnson. It's Dr. Gurgula. I've been asked to send you some of my findings on the human genome. It's only a small portion, and I doubt you'll even be able to comprehend what you're looking at. But I promised Garmantuas I'd provide them. And now please don't contact me again. I'm busy. Am I the only one getting bad vibes from the Dr. Gurglia guy? Is it just me? What is Gurglia? Is it what's the, the sound that you make when you're using mouthwash? Huh? Am I the only one with fresh breath? Fuck me, man. And they're messing with Gatlians. The bad guys did experiments on me and fucked me up real bad in basically every way you can imagine. Holy shit, am I glad to see another Catlian alive in here? Uh, are there any others? Oh my god, yes! There's so many! Oh, but unless you've been alive, then no! These fucking G3 bastards! Creature, we're taking on the cartel! You want in? Oh, no, no, no. They take good care of me. Holding me against my will, cutting me open, doing experiments on me. Okay, you know what? Say it out loud. I think they might actually be bad. I'm part of your team now. Hell yeah. Welcome aboard, uh, creature. That, 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 that's your name? I guess so. Oh, hey, we're locked in. But that's fine. Don't freak out or anything. I can give birth to a bunch of little freaks and they can disable the door lock. It's fine. Beautiful! Look how one of my little fuckers just saved us! What is Being a dad is the best feeling in the world. Then a few seconds later, when your mutant kid dies because it has a microscopic lifespan, that's not so good of a feeling, actually. But I'm numb to it. Ow. Ow. Oh, that's one of my children! They die fast! Don't worry! It's easy to make more, and it feels good! God, I love them so much! Now the fun can start! can do. All right, we're in. How was that? Was that helpful? Was it helpful that I gave birth to a lot of tiny guys really fast? Dude, is this gonna hurt? What is that? I can fight too. Let me Gatlings to Mercs. I gotta be honest. Oh, it turns my stomach. I hate seeing this. Hello! Holy shit, you killed everyone? Wow, you are strong. Good thing I'm safe behind this glass. Oh! Use one of my kids to fuck! Mine. 
He'll go into a frenzy. Did I tell you they can do that? They can. Oh, oh, and if you keep fighting my kids on top of a guy, they can do mind control shit. They can make a bad guy fight for us. Oh, shit. That mind control thing doesn't last very long. Sorry about that. I keep yelling at my kids to make it last longer, but they're shitheads. They do not listen. Not okay, I just want to stab it. Oh, it's great to be outdoors again. Nice to get some fresh air after all those biological horrors. Ooh. Oh, I can help you with that little hook bug hive. Shoot my little guys in there. Look at my little guy in there rustling up the hive. Isn't that cute? I'm so proud of him. Hey, hey, this is fun! Do you do this sort of stuff all the time, Bounty Hunter? Ah, this green water hurts a lot. Almost like it's toxic or something. It might not be. That's just my guess. using Clug's device to save those humans, right? Help us. Please. Let's get nasty. You know how to use Clug's device, yeah? tell you but you know we can use this portal to head back to blim you know whenever we want but uh also find trudging forward
Oracle's here. My clock is ready. The good thing about bugs is but he gives a shit if you kill him. Ready to go. Why the hell we're in this asset? This is totally my thing. I'm good at it. That's Angela Sprindle. Wanna kill him? Oh, fuck. The bounty hunter. Holy shit, is that another Sprindle? The, 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 they're getting away? I'm so proud of you, fuck. Good. Whoa, whoa, 
whoa, whoa, what are you watching in there? Uh, I guess it's supposed to be porn, but it's like alien porn, so I, I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea what I'm watching. I mean, I was able to get off to it, like, after a while. Um, honestly, now I love it, though. Uh, not sure why they want me to jack off this much, but, you know, I'm happy to do it. Like, all the tentacles and the moving parts, it's, I don't know, there's something really endearing about it. Yeah, I, I like it a lot, actually. I mean, if, if I ever get out of here, I, I hope I can, like, bring this with me, at least. I mean, I, I don't even think I could go back to normal porn after this. Nice! Oh, what the hell? What is this? What is this? Why is this in here? I'm trying to jack off. This is really distracting to me, but I'll still be able to do it. Trust me, I've been through a lot. We do not sell food. Look, it's not just because we're in a cafeteria. I want to sell food. I love food. But the Screndles won't just give me a damn license. Heads up, you don't have to leave a tip. Thanks for buying that, even though it's not food. Listen, I keep asking the higher-ups, can we sell food? Can we start to sell food? We're in a cafeteria. But they just don't listen to me. They plug their ears and say, blah, 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 little worker guy, little worker guy. Well, they'll see. One day we're all... Hey, you look like you have good taste. But just make sure it's not the taste buds sort of taste, the food taste. Because we don't have that. We don't have food. Fuck you! How are things going? Even the oh, come on, man! There he goes again! Are you kidding me? Health code radio. The inspector was just here yesterday. So, we're good, I think. Ah, Jesus Christ! I ain't still following you! Hey, hey, this is all good. We're getting there some cardio. Yeah. 
like cockroaches. Whoa, that was creative. That nice work. Ready? 
ready for Sweezy? Ready for Carvin? No, wait, three of them? Fucking hell, what a feast! Oh, alien biology always like uh, just just fucked. It's just fucked, really. Good, delicious. Now let me dig into the last bro. Sitting. Each one more visually better than the last. You know what? I don't see this often, but I'm fully sated right now. I actually need a rest. You there, bounty hunter? Oh no! Is that guy mad to us? That's right. <laughs> I know who you are, and I want you to know how fucked you've made things for yourself. You were living in heaven before you meddled with the G3. Save your breath, all that yipping and yapping. We're about to put foot to ass. We're coming for you. I've got the two most important people in your life, and I'm going to kill them. <laughs> oh, but not right away. First, I'll make things miserable for them. They're going to suffer as much as you've made me suffer. You're just straight evil. I'm not going to ask you to stop. I doubt you'd listen. I'd just like to inform you that I'm going to make sure you die. And that it's going to hurt. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> Besides, you won't even be able to get to my new base on Earth without the proper coordinates. So just sit tight until I come to kill you myself. Well, looks like we're in it. No turning back now. Ah. Another bounty down. Look at us racking them up. <laughs> Good work, bounty hunter. What say we head home? Ah, you killed the Screndel brothers and freed us again. Thank you. Thank you. Everyone else is too traumatized to talk right now. Sorry. We just keep getting captured over and over again, you know? It's a lot to take in. I'm still able to talk because I've been captured the most. I'm just kind of numb to it now. Means nothing to me anymore. You're really on fire, aren't you? Obviously, you're not as good at bounty hunting as I used to be, but hey... I'm gloppy enough to admit you're doing pretty damn well. Turn in that bounty. Yeah. I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads? Maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I mean, my name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but... We'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of Frendelos. Oh, hey, I I'm Tweeg. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. Tweeg, you need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You're just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my Frendelos and tongue kiss your sister? I'm the one who bought those fucking Frendelos. And leave Tweeg alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. 
I can go. No, Tweeg. You're staying. Tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's just after our house. It's our house. Exactly. Hey, Tweeg, you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. Real heartbreaker. I'd get out now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real lover? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, it's my house too. So I don't even know why I have to fight for this. I'm just so pissed at everyone. Oh, Not you, Tweak. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. You really gotta take my nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Shut the hell up, Gene. I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friendalos and use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey, your family's doing a great job. You know how hard it is to kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time? I mean, it's not as fast as... I could have done it, but, uh... I know they're doing a great job, and I'm proud of them. But I'm stuck here dealing with you all the time, and you're fucking pathetic! Tell him how pathetic he is. Hey, right, come on. Don't make it sound so sad. Look, I admit I wasn't in a good place when you found me, but I feel like I'm part of your family now. I'm basically your dad now. You too, Lizzie. I'm your dad. I'm just worried about you dating this weird freak who just wants to steal my couch away from me. You can call it your couch when you start paying rent. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's gonna live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Tweeg. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Tweeg. This isn't about you. Why? Because you're worried you'll have to share a cushion? No! Because I... Because I'm concerned! You barely know this guy, and it's dangerous out there for humans. Oh, that's rich and condescending. I am not an idiot. I know what I'm doing. You're cool with Tweeg moving in, right? Good. Like I needed your approval anyway. This is a mistake. Oh, that's enough of this. Tweeg, let's go to the park. To... <laughs> to... To kiss? <laughs> Anybody got a fucking problem with that? Eesh. Sorry I said anything. Let's just get back to the bounty hunting. Can't wait to show you those new commercials. All right. Here's the skinny. You're all gonna need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. What? More, more than we already have? Uh, our team is mostly guns. Trust me, we need this. Klug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlian. Oh shit, another Gatlian. That's right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. Okay, so what do we do? We do it the old-fashioned way, and ask around. Maybe we find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Maybe you'll appreciate me more if you do my job. Okay, Gene, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll try to find him ourselves. All right. Skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. Bounty Hunter, it's me, Pseudo, again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to detective mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Suddenly? With the fucking detective mode? Well, why haven't we had access to this the whole time? All right, let's see. It looks like you're looking for a... Dr. John Giblets. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Oh, fantastic. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately, and... No matches found. Oh, <laughs> well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? Okay. Okay, I figured it out. This thing's fucking useless. Thanks, Gene. Oh. Hey, 
Hey, uh, did, did you know anything about Dr. Giblets? What are you talking about? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. Looks like you're trying to interrogate a suspect. Let's ask them some questions. What? Why do you care? If you must know, I ate 15 whole sandwiches. And yes, I regret it. I don't know why I ate that many. Do I look nervous? <laughs> oh, jeez, you make him nervous with this interrogation. I'm really sorry. I don't know who that is. But <laughs> good luck, I guess. Hope you find them. Am I what? What is it with you and this Dr. Giblets guy? My name's Craig, and I'm really sick from eating a lot of sandwiches. Leave me alone. Woof, they didn't know anything. That was a real D-rank interrogation. Sorry. Oh, well, maybe you could just find more people to interrogate. You'll get it next time. My name's Poobus. Hey, uh, hey, tough guy. We're, we're looking for a Dr. Giblets. You got, you got any leads? Slick. What the fuck are you talking like that for? Oh, Jesus Christ, leave me alone. I'm just gonna stand here for a little bit. And, uh, you know, it's not, a, it's not good. It's not How are you doing? Like, with your weird interrogation? Awful! Annoying! I wish you'd stop! Okay, um, maybe next time. Quit the, the drug guys. No! I don't have any fucking ties to the evil drug conglomerate. I'm a normal person trying to live a normal life in the city. Why in the fuck would I have any ties to the G3? You know, we gotta wrap this up pretty quick, because if it goes on... What's my whole deal? Like, who am I? What do I do? Well, my name's Jackie T. Pooperton, and what I do is tell you to fuck off! Don't, uh, don't start raving to your friends about how... I don't know, and I don't give a shit! I'm busy! You need anything else, or can I fucking go? Ooh, bummer, they were a tough cookie. But they were telling the truth according to my sensors, so let's say that was a C-rank interrogation. Better luck next time, let's look for somebody else. Hey, what's up, Lordo? You know anything about a, a, a where we could find a guy named Jib, Dr. Giblets? Whoa, 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 where'd you hear that name? You can't just go asking around town for a guy like that. What, why? What, what, what's wrong with asking about Dr. Giblets? I don't know. Why do you think I know anything about Dr. Giblets? I don't know nothing. Now buy something, I'll beat it, buster. Now, now, funny peso bill thing. You got it. You get a good eye. Did Blordo seem a little dodgy to you? I swear I feel like he's hiding something. That's right, yeah, let's come back when we know a little more and see if we can push this guy over the edge. Yeah, well, uh, see you later, Greenbow. Have a good day. Put this I don't care, I just want to stab it. Hey, uh, do you mind if we have a moment of your time? Oh, uh, sure. Uh, what's this about, can I ask? Well, sure. Yeah, I, I don't really have any moral issue with accepting a bribe. It sounds like a win-win, actually. I get money, you get info. But uh, come to think of it, the G3 will kill me, so uh, how about no? I was playing snooker with Blordo. Yeah, he's really bad at it, so I won a few hundred pesos. <laughs> it was a great night. Hey, thanks for asking about my night, pal. It was nice of you. You take an interest in people. That's admirable. Shh, hey, quiet. Don't say his name so loud. I can't help you, but Blordo can. Mention my name, Michael Taint. Then he'll talk. But no cracks about my name. Holy shit, wow, you, we actually got something we can use. Okay, woohoo. That was an A-rank interrogation. Good for you. Let's head over to Blordo and mention Michael Taint. Hello? Hi, is this Slippo's Pizza? I want it right now. Oh, shit. I want it right now. Do you get me? Not in 30 minutes or less or whatever. I need it instantaneous. And I know we have the tech for that. Why are you still delivering pizza by foot? Just zap them to me. There's like 10 different ways you can do it by now. Portal door, work base, anything. I don't care. Just get it to me right now. Wait. Never mind. I'm not hungry. Bye. Danny, 
Hunter, you look hungry. Let me help you out. Look, I said I don't know nothing about Dr. Giblet, so leave me alone. Unless you want to buy something, that's different. You can still buy stuff from me. That's totally fine. Ah, oh, that piece of shit. I'm going to kill him. Look, if you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. The Hyperbong 6 Midnight launches tonight, but you should be able to get in by now. Just don't mention my name. I didn't say nothing. Now get out of here. If anyone sees me talking to you, I'm dead. Thanks, Blordo. We, we had a good feeling you were a true pal. Wow, great sleuthing, detectives. That was an S rank interrogation. That's like a fucking. Hey, this is my favorite VIP. Hey, you don't have to wait through any of this funny business. You are allowed right in, my friend. Yeah, you better. Head straight through. I don't want jerks like you hanging around. Shit, thank you. Okay, so we're looking for this new high on oh, life yeah, store. Hey, hey, Hopefully yeah. the slums uh, are a little more chill now that we took out nine like, torque. Uh, oh fuck, god damn it! Just Look, the slums have always been a mess, but I, I don't like what they're doing over here to this place. It's, it just feels weird. Jetpack when we we had to just 
walk around like assholes? Fuck that shit. You don't understand. This isn't like well consuming loyal on life store number 7923. You're Well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm pseudo, by the way. You know me. Uh yeah, we're we're still tracking down giblets. Yeah, you already know what I'm gonna say. Try interrogating all the employees here. Yeah, no shit. That's what that's what the fuck we're gonna do. Holy shit, this is a madhouse. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? Oh, man, this again. Look, man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck-up. I lied on my resume. I got the manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he looks like. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. But, but you know about him. Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes around, though. I don't really know where he is. Hey, where you going? There's still more stuff you can ask him. What? I told you. I have no idea where he is. And you're being really aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now, and you're distracting the hell out of me. Okay, shit. Not, not so good. L looks like we uh, hit, a, hit a dead end. So let's get the fuck out of here and... Just give up on being detectives. It's all done now. Nice day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like that poke in that beak where I don't belong. Be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you catch our drift. More of this shit? Are you fucking kidding me? More? More of this? Why is everybody on our case today? Please, just fuck off! You got a fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Part of my associate here, yeah? he's only got one good threat, but I assure you, he can back it up. That's right. A word to the wise. Stay out of this. Got it? We've got this covered. What the hell was that? Thanks for Holy shit, what the fuck? Was this guy trampled to death? Uh, yeah. My friend David Glutes got trampled in the rush. Pretty sad, right? One moment he was there, next he's gone. Squashed. Listen, I hate to suggest this, but I think we might need to, you know, borrow that dead guy's mag boots, you know, to, just to climb out of here. Yeah, that's fine. Mag boots. Okay, look, I know this is a little fucked, but these boots are gonna be very hey, useful. Sick move! You're making good use of those mag boots.
Welcome back. We've got company. Hello there. You guys again? How are you? They're cool. We've been observing you. Hope that don't rustle your jimmies none. Because newsflash buckos, we're on your side. We'd like to formally apologize for how we treated you earlier. We didn't realize who we were dealing with. You'll have to forgive us. And we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating you. It's the only way we know how to talk. Our wives hate us. We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Maybe you've heard of him. He's certainly heard of you. Here's the skinny slim. The Torg family, or what's left of it anyway. They got mixed up with a bad crowd. The G3 cartel. Or more specifically, Dr. John Giblet's PhD. And Clug wants it squashed pronto. He says you're the right bounty hunter for the job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblet's. He's been warping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread house. That way Clug don't have to get his cute little hands dirty. You dig? This kid's fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over here. Let's say somebody dies. Maybe, hypothetically, their name is Dr. Giblets. Well, should anything like that happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation never happened. And Clug will be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Huh, all right, let's, let's go talk to Clug. Oh, welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Hey, Clug. Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of Blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with... Dr. Giblets? Well, yeah, no, I mean, we, we that's what we want to do, you know? But uh, it's just the trail went dead. A dead end? Oh, no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. Oh, that's how we get to Dr. Giblets? Whoa, whoa, even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah! All right, then we just kick the door down, burst our way in there, find him, grab him by the neck. Hey, hey, hey! I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. Uh, we will do our best. Find us that fucking Dr. Giblets piece of shit. I said buzz off. How'd it go? Magistrate Clug came through. He pointed us right to Dr. Giblets. That's great. I kind of regret not voting for him. Now get out there and kill Giblets. Things have developed in a sort of weird way over here. Fuck, we got a warp base coming in! Look, I'm just saying, my glove shot might be helpful.
this is nice. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh. oh my God. What, what, what happened? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well it shot me uh, right in half. I got... Hey, come back. Hey, hey, thanks for coming back. Are you really dying? You, you, you sound fine now. <laughs> No, 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 oh, oh, I'm dying. No, I'm actually, oh, not, uh, for real this time, though. Oh, my God, oh, stay, don't go anywhere. Stay with me, thank you. Oh, here, here I go. Oh, my God. Oh. All right, shit, I, I, I guess that's it, then. Hey, hey, what the fuck? You left me again. I'm, I'm not dead yet, assholes. Oh, come. If you leave me again, I swear to God, I'm gonna kill myself. I thought you were already dying. Oh, whoops, whoops. Never, never mind. I, 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 I'm really, I'm really dying now. Now this, oh, for real. This, the, but this time is the real one. Oh, good, good. I can feel it. Oh, fuck. Oh, this really hurts. Good, good, goodbye. I, oh, oh. Okay, this time it's gotta be real. Let, 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 let's just get out of here. It's... Hey, hey, guys, I'm still alive. You need to come back here and stay with me. Okay, fuck this. I, I'm, I'm fine now. I'm fine now. I, I don't think I'm gonna die. But I am so disappointed in you for leaving me in my time of need when you explicitly promised you wouldn't. Listen, we've got places to be. It's important. Can we just wrap this up? Oh, no, wait. I, I'm dying for real now. Oh, 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 my God. Oh. Two steps away, I swear. Oh, shit. I guess he really did oh. finally die. Y you still alive, man? Y you're not just pranking us or something, right? Oh! Uh, I guess, I guess, I guess it's, I guess, I guess it's, that's that, then. Hey, guess what? I'm still alive. Don't leave me. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, never mind. I'm dying now. This one is real. I, I can't do this. Can just shoot him, just to be sure. Okay, so is this Dr. Giblets's base? Where, where the hell is he? Oh, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Jesus Christ! Okay, okay, fine. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation if someone was killing G3 mercs. You know what? That makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. I mean, look at you. That's what you're doing. Looks like your typical work desk. Nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiments. I don't know. I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there. That's what they're used for. That's what drones are for. They're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Oh, 
Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. All right, then. Let's, let's keep moving. Howdy there, cowboys. Uh, oh, shit. Sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives. Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's got to be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. We got this! These must be old hyperbone prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these out, and we can move on to the next thing. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, that's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing it. Whew, look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms. But we already knew that. You know, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for showing me this. All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door! Alright, I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go, go find more clues, baby! Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Jeez, it looks like Dr. Giblets was pissed he didn't get first. Oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. Oh shit, that's a G Gatlian. A regular old Gatlian doesn't look like it's in good health at all. Probably should just let it be, honestly. Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful, did a lot of did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows, let's find out. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. Wait, so we didn't have to find any of those clues? Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much, I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. Giblets. Uh, that was very anticlimactic, but I'm not, I'm not I'm not complaining. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me at him. Dr. Giblets status report. No life sense detected. Entering full security lockdown. Uh -oh. Hello! If you're hearing this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations, you killed me. But I knew this day would come and I was prepared for this moment. Now see if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave. I should have fucking known it wouldn't have been so easy. Everyone called me crazy, but look at me now.
my disc is good to go if you want it. Killing these weak fucks doesn't do anything for me. Okay, is, is that it? Hmm. If you're hearing this, it means you made it past my first onslaught. Perhaps you aren't my son, Crimothy. Yes. Yes, I was wrong. How could I have been so blind? I know who killed me now. It was you, Krubus. What? what, is, what? He, he thinks Krubus killed him? Yes! Jesus Christ, how many of these did he record? <laughs> Fuck them, freaks! Krubus, 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 always complaining about being the lowest rung on the G3 ladder. You thought you could kill me and take my spot at the top, didn't you? Well, think again.
I've made a great mistake. I was wrong. Only one person could have survived all of that. Myself. I killed myself. Finally. It makes sense, you know. I always hated myself. I knew I'd get the guts to do it one of these days. Good for me. Oh, that's dark. So, okay, I killed myself. Whoops. My apologies to whoever's hearing this. I hope you'll forgive me for making you go through all of that. You can leave now. Have a good day. Jibbles out. R.I.P. Jibbles. Wow, okay. Good, 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 good work. I think we can get back out through the trap door now. As I continue to study these humans, I find them to be more complex than I ever could have expected. Initially, I saw great potential in both the Virgils and the Gatlians, but now... Oh, uh, yeah, well, you know what, is he even alive? Uh, you know what, let's take him back to Gene. Gene knows, he can fix, get them all fixed up. Humans. I just wanted to say, you know, that today really meant a lot to me, and, um, uh, God, oh, this is so fucking hard. Um, your free trial of detective mode is up. So see you later. Bye. Oh, thank God. Okay, Bounty Hunter, you go through the menus. You find that detective mode. You shut it the fuck off. Never again. Okay, I'm serious. Oh, look at that. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See? It's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go. Come on over. Let's bow wow. Okay, uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh, shit. That's great. I, 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 I don't know about that. I mean, he, he's, he's not really functional. I don't, I don't, I don't think he's dead, but... Oh, God damn. Yeah, he's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Sure. Do you, do you think he's salvageable? Buddy, I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix it. Okay, th thanks, Gene. But you know, if, if he can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, nothing! I, 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 I was being shitty. You, you, you didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh, trouble around here. Go. turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. Okay, come on over. Let me get... All right, what do you got for us, Gene? All right, which do you want first? The good news or the bad news? All right, here's the bad news. Lizzie's been gone for a while. It's probably nothing, and I'm obviously not actually worried or anything because I, I hate her. But, uh, you know, you, you might want to look into it since she's your sister and all. Maybe check with Tweeg. He works at that Space Applebee's uptown. All right, well, I lied, kid. I don't have any good news. I was hoping you'd just ask for the bad news, and then you'd be so upset you'd forget to ask about the good news. Uh, I was trying to pull a fast one on you, and I failed. So, uh... This is pretty embarrassing. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that's everything. I'll work on getting us some new bounty leads if you want to go look for Lizzie. And, uh, I'm gonna see if I can fix up that busted Gatlian you saved. Jesus, that is a lot to take in, Gene. Hey, uh, Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlians here with Gene and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? Oh, sure, we can use a little break. It's nice to stretch out a bit, you know? Take a little nappy poo. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Change the channel, Gene, to porn. Have a good time, you two. We'll hold down the four. All right, bounty hunter, let's head to Applebee's and we're, we're, let's find your sister. <laughs> you, you'd never judge me, right? I mean, we're such close partners at this point, you know? Like, nothing I could say could ruin that, right? <laughs> I'm just just kidding around. Just I'm just joking around. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm out of my body right now, I think. I'm worried about your sister. You, you think Tweak is working today?
Welcome to Applebee's. Table for two, right this way. Oh, uh, actually, we're wondering if someone named Tweeg is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to talk. Uh, yes. We, 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 will, we will take a table. Enjoy your meal. Your waiter will be with you shortly. Thank you. Okay, listen, I I'm sorry for making us sit here at Applebee's. I know we're really focused on Lizzie, and that's kind of the important thing, but would you mind if I kind of got something off my chest here with you first? Whew, okay, thanks. You know, it's just, you know, it it's going to weigh me down if I don't say something. Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? It got taken over by the G3, like yours. You know, all my people got enslaved. Y y you remember that, right? You know all that, right? Sorry, of course you do. Well, um, what if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? Uh, okay, I, I can see you're at a loss for words. I, I, I know how it sounds. I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm going to be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started with one of our signature cocktails? Uh, not, not now, please. We're, we're kind of busy here. Okay, sure thing. I'm going to go ahead and get that in for you. Uh, thank you. Okay, bounty hunter, so l l let me explain. Gatlas was isolated on the far edge of an asteroid belt. We were completely untouched by the greater interstellar civilization, j just like your planet. But, you know, I, I wanted out. Like, I wanted to see the galaxy. I wanted to see what everything out there had to offer. That's when Rel Del Mar crashed his ship into our planet. He was this crazy smuggler. He, he'd been all over and he'd seen it all. And, 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 and after I helped him fix his ship, he wanted me to be a part of his crew, you know? And he, he took me with him. And I'm back. Here we go. This is for you. All right, now what were you thinking for an appetizer? Uh, I'm sorry. We're in the middle of something, please. Great, it's coming right up. Oh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but wh where were we? Okay, oh, right, um, obviously a guy like Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers, and, well, you know, that led us to the G3, and Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower, and, well, looking back, you know, I see how stupid I was, you know, I, I really do, but at the time, I couldn't tell, you know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. You know, everyone thought I was a fuck-up, you know? I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something, you know? Open up. Here comes the appetizer train. Chicka, 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 choo-choo. Thank you. I ho hope you like those. Now you better be ready to order that main course. You betcha. I'm going to get that order right to the cook. Okay, thank you. So... I led the G3 right to Gatlas. Do you see where I'm going with this? We fought them off at first, you know, but they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. You know, a few of us were immune. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Les Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived, and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now, about how I left Gatlas to pal around with a criminal, how I led Garmantuous and the G3 right to our planet, how I got everyone killed, except Let's Do It survived. Somehow, the G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. God, if we can really bring him back, do, do, do you see my problem, right? Like, I, I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did, you know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Emotional thing. Uh, you know, this is important baggage shit we're dealing with here. Take a hint and get out of here for a second. Uh-oh, someone's feeling grumpy. Oh, wonderful. Now, wh what the fuck is happening outside? Lizzie? Don't follow us. Twig and I are in love, and we're going to travel the galaxy in his space RV. Uh, actually, this is moving kind of fast. Not Help me, please. Not finish that sentence. We're in okay, love. we gotta get to them. Oh, 
Oh, shit, yeah. We, I can't dine and dash. I love this place. Don't want to get blacklisted. Oh, fuck. I'm this, here live in downtown Glim City, bad. where, as you can see, we've been invaded by violent and agitated G3 cartel forces. No one can say for sure why they're here. We're here to kill you, bounty hunter. <laughs> okay. Well, there you have it. It looks like this is only a problem if you are that bounty hunter that they're trying to kill. I'm Peter Parkinson, Glim City News. Stay safe out there. Jesus! Come on, come on, keep up the pace! We have to get back later. to the house! That's right, let's go, we're gonna hurry! Oh yeah, I've been here the whole time, but, but don't worry, I'll keep your secret safe. I'm, I'm not a snitch. Hey, what's going on, best buddy? Hey, just so you know, man, I'm gonna be really upset with you. Yeah, to walk Freddy, but 
three can we go with? A G3 won't follow. I'll handle that. Can you pull off the Hennison maneuver mid-warp to juke them? Can I what? Did you make that up? Can you scramble the warp? Fine, yes, scramble the warp. Bounty Hunter, bring me to the warp core. close. I may be 230, but I don't want to die yet. Are we? Did, did we make it? Yeah. We're safe. Nobody on our tail, but uh, where are we? Am I missing something? I'm not picking up any signs of life out there. Then we're in the right spot. Kenny, where did you just take us? It was the only safe place I could think of. Careful. It's toxic out there. I set up an atmos bubble so you can breathe, so don't wander too far. Or do. The what does it matter anymore? Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? Pretty soon Earth is gonna look like this too. We have got to stop the G3, bitch. Sorry, nobody answered me. I asked if this was our home. Anyone? God, yes, creature. It was our home, and it got all fucked up. We're, we're, we're trying not to think about it too much. Got it. Thank you. Well, it looks like shit. How is it out there? We, we, we don't want to talk about it. That bad, huh? Well, uh, don't get all depressed about it. We still got more guys out there to kill. Let's powwow real quick. Look, I hate to be pushy, but are you ready for your next bounty? You know what, kid? Maybe you should get some rest. Let's save the bounty hunting for tomorrow. Head on upstairs. I'll take care of things down here. I hate to say it, but Gene's right. Let's get some shut-eye. We'll make this right starting tomorrow. So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. All right, you're finally up. Okay, let's get back to it, I guess, you know? I, I, I hope Gene has a lead on Lizzie. Let's go. Yeah, look who finally decided to wake up. You know how late it is? Because I don't. There's no sun on this dead rock of a planet. By the way, I got you a little sum sum. A new suit upgrade. Extra overshield. You're welcome. Let's get to business. I've got something you'll like. You can breathe easy. I'll get right to it. I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. Oh, that's great. So, so she's... She's alive. Don't worry. But she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. If you're ready, just step through the portal door. I don't know what I want. Okay, fine, I don't know either. Isn't the sex good? I don't know. I can't even tell if we're doing it right. We're aliens. None of our shit even lines up correctly. You could be pregnant and I would fucking wonder how that happened. My cum goes all over outside of your body. Well, okay. I don't know if it's good either. Your body is really confusing. God, I'm just so confused. Aren't we in love? You're asking me that, dude. You're the one who dragged me out on this trip. 
I wasn't looking for anything serious. I just wanted to get laid. But even that turned out to be some weird fucking Hellraiser puzzle. Oh, shut up. Don't blame this on me. There's plenty of ways you could have figured out how to use my equipment, so to speak. Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, yeah, thank God. You came just in time to save me. Me is who you came to save. Thank you. Fuck your sister, dude. Woo. Cuckoo. Girls, am I right? Love is tough. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I don't know. We're a little worried about you. God, everyone needs to chill out. When have you smoked? What, you're a smoker now? Wait, what is it? Camels? Marlboro? Marble? 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 Marbleos? Marlboros? I don't know. What's it to you? What do you want? Well, I don't want to come home. It's not even my home anymore. It's Jean's jack-off mansion, and it's your little clubhouse where you can unwind for a few minutes between bouts of, oh, I don't know, murdering criminal gang lords. Hey, I'll go home. You can take me home. How about that? I'm your new sister. Congratulations. Just get me the fuck out of here. No, you're staying, Tweed. We're in love. Say it. Say we're in love. Okay, never mind. I can't go. I have to be in love with your sister. Look, I hate to be insensitive, but it's dangerous out in space for humans right now. We even got chased out of Blimp City by the G3. Whoa, really? Yeah, it was rough. Listen, I get that there's a lot right now that's bothering you, but can we convince you at least to just come home with us and figure it out there? But I'm busy being in love with Tweeg. Uh, yeah, we're busy. Sorry. So just leave. Unless... What else were you worried about? Oh, yeah? How? Yeah, how about you just let me handle this on my own? You already decided to become a weird alien killing expert. Don't strain yourself trying to be a dating expert, too. Um, yeah, no offense, but you're kind of butting in, dweeb. Hey, only I can talk to them that way. And look, I'm sorry I dragged you out here. Really, I am. I know you didn't want to. But I just, I wanted to know for sure if if we worked or not. Oh, yeah, it's cool. I forgive you. I just think, oh, oh, really? Even after forcing you to leave with me? Yeah, okay, it's fine, yeah. Did you know I almost sold you out to the G3? They were offering, like, a lot of pesos to find out where you were. And that would have been way worse. What the fuck, Twig? You piece of shit! Wait, what? Y y you're joking, right? No, I really almost did it. Like, I had my phone out and everything. If Lizzie hadn't dragged me on this trip, I probably would have. I'm not good. I'm a shithead. Lizzie shouldn't be dating me. Gene was right. And it's a little fucked up because he was being a misogynist, but he was actually right. I do suck, and I'm fine with it. That's just who I am, and I love it. So fuck off. Love it. Well, Jesus, I was about to do a, a whole thing about how we should take a step back and slow things down, but you know what? Fuck you, Tweek. Yeah, th yeah, Tweek, fuck you. Hey, thanks for coming to get me. Seriously, it, it means a lot. Uh, okay, enough. Let's go. You got it. Smell you later, Twig. We're back. You're safe. Uh, I mean, fuck you. And fuck you, too. Okay, happy reunion. Everyone's fine. Can, can we just get back to bounty hunting? Yeah, 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 yeah. Clug just sent over the data on Nipulon, so you can head out while I fix Les to it. Did you, uh, know how much firepower this guy's packing? He's gotta be at least ten times as powerful as any of you other Gatlians. Wait, you really think you're gonna be able to fix him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have them all patched up by the time you get back. Y you're serious? That, that, that soon? Yeah. Don't worry about it, kid. Your friend's gonna be just fine. Old Papa Gene watched a bunch of GooTube tutorials, and now he knows his way around cybernetics. That's, that's, that's great. It's, it's just... What? You don't sound too happy. You know how hard I've been working to save this guy? Fuck. Whew. Okay. I guess it's now or never, Bounty Hunter. Can you set the other guns down on the table for me, real quick? 
Hey, everybody. I, I, I need to come clean about... Uh, well, sh f this is f way tougher than I thought. Spit it out. Yeah, spit it out. No, I, I, I can't. I, you're going to hate me. Dad, th we, we don't have secrets. We're a family. Well, hold on. I might decide to hate him. It's okay, Kenny. You can tell us. Oh, just fucking say it. Okay, fine. If you don't hear it from me, you're just going to hear it from Les Do-It when he wakes up. Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason that G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'll be mad. I, I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... fuck. He's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. Kenny, how? That doesn't even make sense. How could it be your fault? I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But, but how could that be possible? We didn't even have interstellar travel on Gatlas yet. I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and I was going nowhere, and, and, and he took me with him on these adventures, and it was supposed to be, you know, this fun, awesome thing, and but then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. It all happened so fast, I, I thought they killed Let's Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. I, I didn't know he, I didn't know he was going to survive. You mean you didn't think you'd ever have to tell us the truth. No, 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 that's not it. I, I... Oh, this is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See? I'm not the biggest fuck up here. Not now, dude. Everyone, please. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. Let's just... Oh, okay. Let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Sure. Easy. Done. What's next on the agenda? Forgive Garmantuous too? Come on. That, 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 that's not fair. Don't fight. I'm sure we can all figure this out. No, Creature. He can't just drop that bomb on us and expect everything to be the same. I, I'm sorry. Look, I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. Nipulon may not stay where he is for long, so I know things aren't... The ideal, but, uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy, you don't mean that. Enough! Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. You're professionals! You're bounty hunters! Act like it! Mm-hmm. Fine. <laughs> okay, yeah. Gather everyone up. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Tarine, so we gotta strike now. Can you handle that? Let's just get this over with. Hey, in the event that I made it... Okay, we just need to sneak into Nipulon's lounge. Let's try... Can it, traitor! We'll handle this one! We don't want you selling us out. Kitty, do us all a favor and sit this one out. Hey, stop fighting! I hate it when everyone's fighting! We need to talk things over in a healthy way. No, 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 no. We just need to cover ourselves in goop again. It's not complicated. That's true. We should do that. But I also think we need to have a really fun time at the saloon. So go there first, please. Uh, whatever. It's it's up to you, Bounty Hunter. Head over to Dregtown and get gooped up or try hashing this out at the saloon. For your services, we would like to get gooped again, if you if, if you could. Oh, no can do, partner. See, my little gooper trooper here is sick as can be. Looks like he's not gonna make it. Truth be told, I don't think I'll ever be gooping anybody ever again. <laughs> Unless we get him that medicine. Medicine? Well, maybe we can help. Oh, no way! Thank you so much! Wow, that's so nice of you. There's a special flower over there in uh, the other side of Tareen Ravine. But good luck getting over there, because that ravine is tearing through the valley, if you know what I mean. Those damn mac and cheese brothers are taking forever to build the bridge. I mean, if you could get them to do their jobs, then maybe we could get the flower and save my little goopa. Don't worry, we, we, we got it. We could do it. Well, shit. I don't want to get my hopes up, but thank you so much. You want to 
see my Kenny impression? Huh? Um, um, can, can, can you stop by the G3 headquarters real quick so, so I can sell out all my friends? Gosh, Kenny's still our friend. No, it's fine. Let him go nuts. Wait, I can do one too. Oh, uh, nobody loves me and I suck. Uh, I'm a piece of shit. A big dumb sicko who loves getting everyone killed. Oh, hey, me too, Marky. Me too. You know, they, hey, hey, whoa, whoa, Buster. What are you doing? Okay, so you're not leaving, are you? You're just fucking barging in. What do you want from us? Hey, we're, we're just trying to look for a way across. Well, tough luck. You, you, you think you own the world? You want to get across the ravine? You got to wait for us Mac and Cheese Brothers Brothers to do our work. Yeah. Yep. Come on, you're telling me there's nothing we can do? No, sorry, pal. Listen. We got our own emotional shit right now. You know, we're, we're on strike until Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers, you know, he comes back from that goddamn saloon in Old Town and he tells us he loves us Mac and Cheese Brothers, his sons. You, you want us to get your dad to love you? All right, listen, we just need to hear that he loves us. That's it. We ain't working until we find out, okay? Hey, we're the Mac and Cheese Brothers. Yeah, you can't do shit. You're, you're a piece of shit. Fuck you. <laughs> you fucking bitch. You little bitch. when you do that. Oh, you're leaving? Okay. Uh, I'll just be here. I'm not letting go. Uh, sorry. Does anyone know where we can find uh, Papa Mac and Cheese? Hi, uh, we're trying to find a Papa Mac and Cheese. You best mind your own business, please, for, for everyone's sake. Hi, you might be able to help us. We're trying to find a Papa Mac and Cheese. Watch yourself. Don't want to go get yourself in trouble. Excuse me, you know where uh, Papa Mac and Cheese might be? Never heard of them. And if I had, I'd keep quiet. I'm sorry, we're looking for a Papa Mac and Cheese. Eh, don't look at me. I mean, don't let them see you looking at me. Hey. Yeah? I'll tell you what Papa Mac and Cheese is. If you do this guy. What? No, not me. Please pick anybody but me, please. Well, huh? A duel? Okay, okay. Well, you know what? Listen, whatever. We'll do it. You know the rules. Stand five feet apart, count to three, then draw. Last man standing wins the fuck a duel. Come on, man. I, I don't want to do this. Come on, it'll be fucking fun. Go on, then. Get to your mark. What's the matter with you? You gotta stand on your fucking mark and a fucking door can't start. Or we could just skip it. Perfect. Here we go then. Jeez. I'll count you down. Shoot at each other on fucking draw, all right? Three. All right, we got this. Two. I believe in you. I think. One. Whoa there. You shot early. You play fucking dirty. Get him, boys! Whoa, this choke might be one of the choke the time! I'm Papa Mac and Cheese, brothers! You can fucking kill me! Oh, whoa, we fucked that up. You won't be needing this. Would be here hey, still. So I am. What, what, what did Papa say? Huh? Does he love us or not? I got the will to live here. Ugh. Listen, I'm sorry, I'm but the he, strongest he, of the he wouldn't say that he, he loves sure. you. He, he I'm gonna say prove it, it too. Oh, fuck him. God, of course, typical piece of shit asshole. Oh, oh, that you know oh, it's we a dull, deep pain. It's a dull. It's like a dull, oh, it's like a dull strengthy. Actually, it's like no, a dull. No, if I describe that. it, it's like a dull, deep. We, we need our dad. We need pain Papa. right there. We need him oh, so bad. Right there. I love oh. my dad so much. Even if he hates me, I love him with all my heart. I'm bleeding over, overflowing with love, and I don't care. I'm gonna breathe. It's it's a curse to keep loving him. Such a shitty, heartless father, but I'm I'm bursting with love. I'm bursting with love. Oh, oh. my God. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Well, right, the sure flower should just be right on the other side of this canyon. When you get back. What are we going to find? All right, we did it. Let's get this back to the goop salesman and fix up his gooper.
All right, heads up, warp base. Oh, you're back. Well, look who's still alive, me. Sorry if I'm a little distracted. I, I, I've, I've got a lot on my mind. You know, like all my friends blaming me for genocide. This one. It was no problem, but actually, no, it was, it was really tough, uh, but you're welcome, you know, uh, yeah. Okay, oh my god, as good as new, you really saved his life, I don't know how I could ever repay you. Oh, that's right, he could shit his goop all over you. Wow, you healed him up so nice, his goop's gonna last even longer than before, so you're gonna be covered in shit for such a long time. That's great. Ugh. All this fucking work just to get covered in this shit again. Wow, you look great. Real cool. Damn it, now our cover's blown. We didn't have to fight them, you dipshit. We don't have to fight. Haha, <laughs> a properly gooped G3 minion. You must be here for your one free spa day. Please enjoy your stay. It's working. spa day please continue forward oh uh, oh thank you okay this is going well just gotta keep our cool and sneak our way through
a guest. Please allow me to show you to a private booth right this way. Let's just play along. They might lead us right to Nipulon. We do hope you'll find your time here satisfactory. Remember, we're here to cater to your every need. You name a drug, we have it. Zero G, Fergals, and yes, we're now serving every type of human. We've got young teenagers if you're looking for something big, or perhaps you'll prefer the gentle high of an elder human years away from death. If you're not sure, babies are a little more heady. It's less of a body high. Basically, Whatever you're looking for. Ah, the main atrium. You can see how much of a good time everyone is having. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, who's here? Holy shit! I can't remember. Names they lasted a little longer. We can suck these humans dry way too fast. Wait a minute! Bring me six more humans. More babies if you got them. I like them best young and infant. And now, <laughs> please follow me to your booth. Hey, waiter, can I get a few more humans when I get a chance? Of course, sir. I hope you don't mind sharing your booth with another guest. We're a bit overbooked today. Sorry. Yeah, you ever try human? This shit's amazing. Oh, yeah. Look how dumb they look. All hair and weak. We're lucky they gave you so fucking high. Otherwise, they'd be a waste of a species. Oh, fuck. I love seeing the light leave their eyes. Yeah, fuck this. Do what you have to do. What's wrong?
My dick is red. Stop the G3. Everyone else can just fuck off. Sorry, but you should have never joined up with the bad guy. impression isn't mean it's it's actually kind of sweet Question. Do you think we're being too hard on Kenny? Probably not. I'm sure Kenny deserves every last bit of it.
Tanner. <laughs> it's Helen. <laughs> Can I just call you BH? <laughs> I won't. Nipulon will see you shortly. Just, you know, can I get you anything? Helen, well, what are you doing here? Yep, you keep killing all my bosses, so I have to keep finding new ones to work for. <laughs> Why don't you take a seat for a moment? Good idea. Let's rest those legs. We got we got something coming up here. So, uh, how much longer do we have to wait? Any minute now. We appreciate your patience, thoughts, and prayers. Hey, Kenny, you want to skip the boss fight and just give ourselves up to Nipulon? Let him kill your friends for old time's sake? Great, just what I needed. Some more time to sit and feel like shit. Uh, uh, you do understand why we're mad at you, right? Yeah, no shit, and, and, and I'm sorry. You don't think I'm sorry? Guys, not in front of Helen. Oh, don't mind me. <laughs> I love overhearing stuff. I call it the Erie Canal. <laughs> I don't know what I need to do to prove myself to everyone, but I'm sorry for my part in how things played out. I suffered too. I'm still suffering. Ugh, save the waterworks. Let's just stop the G3, and then we'll never have to see each other again. No holidays, no celebrations, no birthdays, no anniversaries, nothing! That's not what we want! It's what I want. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Understood. Okay, Nipulon will see you now. Well, look who it is. The big bad bounty hunter. Finally paying me a visit. You don't get it, do you? You still think you're the hero? Wrong! Just once. Alright, look, we're fucked up. We got enough problems without your mom on it. You anti drug crusaders make me sick. Evolution made you into the perfect biological drug. It's only natural that other beings take advantage. It's how things are meant to be. Do you really hate being a drug this much? Maybe you just haven't had a taste of how fun drugs can be. Ooh, looks like it's really kicking in. Have fun. Well, uh... I've been meaning to ask you, why are you doing all this? Don't you get it, kid? There's no hope for you. You're gonna end up just like me. Probably gonna lose your legs, too. I used to be something. Now look at me. Don't fool yourself, kid. This is your future. You're just Gene 2.0, and you're going straight down the drain like I did. You really think so? That's what I used to think too, kid. I thought I was invincible. Bounty hunter. Sounds like such a cool job. But really, you're just a glorified garbage man working freelance to take out the trash for anyone willing to pay. Risking your body. For what, kid? So you can lose your legs and find yourself all alone with no one to help you pick up the pieces because you killed everyone you ever met? Does that sound good to you? It does suck. It sucks a lot. You could have lived a way more fulfilling life. Except, well, actually, no, you couldn't have because you would have just been killed by the G3, so this was really your only option. Okay, fine. I don't really know what my point was. See ya. Later, kid. I think we need to go deeper. So let me get this straight. Your mad humans are just drugs to be shipped around and sold off? Well, that's how things work, moron. It's a circle of life. We're just making the best of it. Be mad at evolution, not us. Yep, it's me again. A whole lot of me. Too many nip 
but it says there's too many nipple lines everywhere. It's hard to tell which one's which, but we gotta find the real one. Hey there, sleepyhead. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm gonna be the one who's gonna be Minecraft. Do you play those games? I'm trying to do a sort of serious thing I can actually. I'll say you play 90 hours of Rocket League. Wow. Quite the auto score. Ooh. This one's the real me. Does one of me move a little differently or something? Yep, it's me again. A whole lot of me. There's so many of them. W which one, one of them is real? Hey there, sweetheart. <laughs> How deep are you? Don't worry. I'll kill you before it gets too bad. All right. Let's see how many hours you log in for or uh, Minecraft. Do you play those games? I'm trying to do a sort of cycle. Play game. Uh, let's just say you played 90 hours of Rocket League. Wow. Quite the auto sports fan. <laughs> Ooh, which one's the real me? Does one of me move a little differently or something? Yep, it's me again. A whole lot of me. Too many nipples, there's just too many nipple lines everywhere. It's hard to tell which one's which, but we gotta find a real one. Hey there, sleepyhead. Having a good trip? Uh, How deep are you? Uh, Don't worry. I'll kill you before it gets too bad. <coughs> All right. Let's see how many hours you log in Fortnite or uh, Minecraft. Do you play those games? I'm trying to do a sort of psychomantis thing so I can actually access your game. Uh, let's just say you played 90 hours of Rocket League. Wow. Quite the auto sports thing, yeah? Huh? Ah. Oh, you got me. Big deal. Let's say you tackle another round of combat with your inner demons. I need a pillow. Does anybody have a pillow? Is there jammies? Does anybody have any jammies? Lizzie's here! Get Lizzie, get Lizzie some jammies too! Hey idiot! You need to come talk to me, or mom and dad are gonna be pissed. Do you really think you're doing this to save humanity? You do realize you're just playing the hero, right? Everyone else is dying, but you get to run around space with your little toys, pretending to be the savior of the universe. You're not a hero, you're selfish. This is all about you. Oh yeah? So this is all happening just because some talking gun told you to carry him around and shoot alien drug dealers? And you just went along with it willingly? You didn't do anything with your life and now you want to play pretend hero. Well, guess what? It might actually be working. I mean, I don't know anyone else who's doing anything to stop the G3. This might actually be, it might be the right thing for you to do. Oh my God, you. You really are humanity's only hope, aren't you? Fuck. Keep going till you can't go deep. De is there an end to deeper? Is, when, 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 when does deeper end? Is there a, is, does deeper end? Or does deeper keep on going deeper and deeper? How you doing? Need some motivation to keep going? How about an award? Here, take this one that says you spent all your in-game playtime at an alien strip club. Oh, that's permanent, by the way. Everyone on your friends list can see that forever now.
How are you holding up? Facing some dark truths? Maybe things are a little confusing? Well, I'll make it clear for you. You're our product! And I'm helping you learn your place. What's, what's happening? What is happening? All the Nippelons are back. How do we get more Nippelons from the original Nippelons we had earlier? How do we get more Nippelons? <laughs> Hey, here's a hack for you. Switch to the other controller port, and you won't be able to hurt me. <laughs> Just what? kidding. There aren't any controller ports anymore. Wait. Ha! Was that even the real me? God, you're really having a rough go of this. How much longer can you hold on to your sanity? Looks like you're having enough trouble just keeping your little band of hero guns together. Where, where, where did everyone go? Bounty Hunter, where you at, buddy? Oh, fuck my head. Oh, no, I'm all lost. Oh, my God, you found me. I was freaking out. I, I was worried. I was worried I'd lost you. There's my buddy. There we are. I was on the fence for a minute there, but deep down I knew you wouldn't leave me behind. I'm literally so happy to see you again. You have no idea. I was for real for you. About time. How'd you even manage without me, huh? Oh, great. Another blank void. How the hell did we get out of this? I... Kenny, 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 what is it now? I... I don't know. Oh, Kenny. I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry I let everyone down. I, I was selfish and stupid, and I beat myself up for it every single day, and I'm so glad I found all of you because you've given me reason to live again. Oh, Kenny. Well, don't get all mushy about it. I, I, ju I just, I just want to make things right. You can. We all can. Well, to be honest, I'd given up on everything before you guys came along. Before I found all of you, but now we're a team and we're unstoppable. God damn it, he's right. You, you mean, you mean it? Yeah, dumbass. We've all made mistakes. I mean, not Kenny level planet wide genocide mistakes, but we've all made mistakes. And there is no way we're letting your big, big fucking mistake keep us from taking down the G3. So let's kick some fucking ass together. Yeah, that sounds good. Everything they just said sounded really good and smart. I love you all so much. You're the first real family I've ever had. Except for my little kids I spawn and shoot at bad guys. And the family I probably had before the G3 fucked with my brain and ruined all my memories. Let's do this, bounty hunter. As a family! Thanks, everyone. Let's fucking do this. All right, that's it. I'm going to erase all your game data now. I can do that. It's easy. You'll have to start all over. Here we go. You ready? Okay. Did that work? No? Shit, you're still here? I don't actually know how to do that. Never mind. Forget this. What are you doing? You're supposed to be spiraling into darkness, not growing stronger. This should be happening. I don't see what the real job is. Most people can't handle this. Stop fighting back. This is supposed to be dark compared to me.
right, okay, we're back. I think we're back. That was a lot. Is, is everyone okay? It, it looks like we really killed him at least. He's, he's dead. I, I'm doing Jenny. I feel bad. And, and, I, and I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, me too. I love you guys. Okay, the Earth coordinate should be logged in here somewhere. <laughs> Fuck yeah, Biatch, we got him. Oh, okay. All right, I'm good. Let, let's let's cut a nipple off. Let's do it. No, no, no! Wrong wire. Wrong wire. Shit. Careful, you old bag of shit. You already messed up everything else in your life. You don't want to mess this up, too. No, shut up. Like you'll want to talk after your little Winnebago honeymoon. Whoa, be, be, be careful with him. Real smooth, Gene. That's supposed to happen. I know. I meant that sincerely. I just don't know actually how to be nice to you. Gene almost killed your super gun all over again. Don't listen to her. I'm about to do some real Frankenstein shit here. Oh, God. I don't know if I'm going to be able to look him in the eye. That's fine. I think we accidentally severed his optic nerves earlier. What are you staring at, dork? Oh, for fuck's sake. You know, I thought you were actually going to say something nice. Yeah. Or maybe thank you for watching all these GooTube tutorials on Gatlian surgery while you were out cutting off a guy's nipples. Fine, thank you. All right, almost got it. Stand back, everyone. Here we go. Is he? Wait for it. Let's do it. Les, is that, is that you? Let's do it. Oh, I might have fucked up his speech centers too. Let's do it. Let's do it. Talk to me. Let's do it. So what, all he can say is his name? This is sad. Listen, everything else I did was perfect. He can shoot, he can think, he can shit, he just can't talk right. But he's all in there, right? Like, he knows who I am? Let's do it. Les, I, I can't. Let's do it. I'm so sorry, I... Let's do it. I, I can't believe I didn't have to tell everybody what I did. Are you kidding, are you kidding me right now? Fuck off, kitty. Kenny. Fuck off. What? What? I And I'm happy to see my friend, okay? Fuck. See, I'm not the worst scumbag here. Wow, this is really it, huh? Let's do it. You got the Earth coordinates, right? It's time for your final mission. Hey, kid. Looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. <laughs> this might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? You bet, kid. Take all the time you need. Humanity was sort of doomed in. Hey, kid. Looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. <laughs> this might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? All right, then. You're gonna need Les Do It. All right, let's do it. We got this. Let's do it. Let's walk this house back to Earth. Let's do it. Okay, dude, we get it. Let's do it. Too scared to look outside. Hey kid, 
Before you go, come talk to me. I've got one last thing. Once you step out of the house, we're gonna warp away to safety until the deed is done. That means you'll be on your own. No, not alone. The power of Gatlas will be on a, a, at our side. Yeah, no shit. We know that. I'm just... Uh, God, it was just a figure of speech, Kenny. Look, our Mantuas is tough. You might not be able to beat him even with Lesdwit. So, if push comes to shove, use this. What is it? A remote atomizer bomb. Intel says Garmantuas has thick skin like armor, but if you can get this inside him somehow, then trigger it remotely? Well, let's just say his guts should still be easy to fuck up. This'll blow him up for good. Y you really think we're gonna need that? I don't know. Just don't want you to die. You're happy now? Happy that you forced me to admit I give a shit? Just take it. This thing was hard as hell to find. Thanks, Gene. You know, we, we, we care about you, too. Okay, cool. Fuck off. Good luck. Don't you dare fucking die on me. We'll be waiting to celebrate with you when you... Holy shit, this is... This is awful! But, but there's still time to save your people! Let's do it! Yes, exactly! for you dipshit. I'm 
Everyone feeling we're, we're almost there. There, there, there. There's no time for feelings. Let's just focus on killing Comanchus. Yeah, not the time for chit chat, Kenny. Oh, come on, you're not still manager. Look, it's complicated. Kind of mad still, yeah. Yes, it's complicated. We all love you, Kenny. It's, 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 it's complicated. Like I said the first time, it's complicated. But we had that powerful shared drug experience together, and we we, we learned so much about ourselves and, and working together. Look, and Kenny, we, we... there's a lot of shit to work through here. We're not gonna solve it in one drug trip. Maybe we did, though. You know we're here with you, Kenny. You're, you're, you're practically family, and, and we mostly only have each other. But it's not that easy. Yeah, so let's just kill Garmantuas and see where things go from there. We'll completely forgive you after we kill Garmantuas, Kenny. Creature, that's not true. But it's not, not true. Okay, I, I get it. Let, let, let's just do this. Let's do it. And I'm here too. Knifey, your friend. Remember me? Hey, Sweezy, you take this one. And that's why I've always been the best gun. Let's do it. Okay, give it to me straight, guys. Do you really think we can beat Garmantuous? With let's do it? Yes. Big time. He fucks shit up. We're unstoppable. Yeah, I guess. We can do this, Kenny. Creature's right. We can. We can do this. I hope so. I just don't... I don't want to let everybody down again. I'm just glad I can help, too. See? I'm still pretty handy, huh? This 
is it. It's him. So, are you ready to fucking die? What? No, we're not gonna die. What, what the heck? You're putting me in a fucking diagram? I told you you don't have a chance against me. You're gonna fucking die. I'm really fucking strong. Shove that bomb all the way up his asshole into his intent or whatever's up there. Okay, that should be good. Now pull out and let's blow this fucker up. It's time for the G3 to become the G0. Suck my ass. Okay, what's wrong? Is, 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 is it broken? God damn it, Gene, the remote's busted. Oh, shit. Oh, hello. You're fucking done. Now it's time to make you really suffer. Let's make a deal. If you give up and turn yourself over to me, then I won't harm the two people you love most in this world. Fuck, he's got your parents. Behold! Uh, hey, it's me, Jack Black. Hi, I'm Susan Sarandon. D do we know you? Huh? Are those your parents? Parents? What, what the fuck are you talking about? I don't think the bounty hunter even knows these people. Yeah, we don't. But it's so nice to meet you. So what? You don't love these two? Because every human I asked said they loved them. Well, yeah, everyone loves us. I'm sorry, Bounty Hunter. I'm sure your parents are still out there somewhere, you know? They're alive. I I, I can feel it. <laughs> okay, Bounty Hunter. Enough fucking around. Let's finish this. Ha <laughs> ha 
I know a way to detonate it. I knew you'd figure it out, Kenny. I'll go inside of his asshole, and I'll detonate it manually. Oh, that's not good. Kenny, that would mean... Yeah, I know. Kenny, we're not letting you do that, okay? There's gotta be another way. Can you think of anything? Actually, no, I can't. I guess this is the only way. You're gonna blow both yourselves up? Kenny, you might die. I, I know. Hey, bounty hunter, fighting alongside you has been... Well, it's been the best thing that's ever happened to me. Thank you for giving me the adventure of a lifetime. Now shove me deep inside that monster slug's dirty asshole. Kenny! I want to do this. I, I need to do this. Okay. Okay. Well, I guess this is goodbye. You're the best bounty hunter I've ever seen. And you're an even better friend. See you later, pal. I'll always be with you, and I love you. Oh, 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 shit, it's done! Commander was is dead! He's fucking dead! Rest in peace, fucker. Good work, bounty hunter! What about... There's no way they could have survived that. What a noble sacrifice. I can't believe it. No fucking way! Oh my god, they survived! They made it! Let's do it! I'm... I'm alive? Is Garmanchu is dead? We owe you big time. The whole universe owes you. Now you're a fucking hero. I'm so glad you made it. We did it. <laughs>